And now, another episode of Crit Camp Gaming. That's right, Lyle. I'm playing the wrong music. I meant to hit this. Because we're coming in here for some Mystic Veil vale Druid battling action. <laughs> and I wanted to hit the wheel spin music because it's fun rather than this. And I hit the wrong button again. It's good day. <laughs> I was like, I don't hear anything. <laughs> you don't hear anything. But what's going on, everyone? It's uh, March 12th. It's a night stream, Lyle. What? It is a night stream. It's a Thursday night stream, which we haven't done in a very, very long time. Oh my gosh, and Sea all the Otter, alerts. because we did Thursday night stream, Sea Otter's back. All the alerts are final. <laughs> Look at all the tags are popping up on the over. Yeah. <laughs> like, we've got <laughs> follows coming in. Welcome to the camp, Face of Flynn. Uh, what's up, Sea Otter, the 36 months? What's going on, everyone, guys? Mystic Veil is officially on Switch consoles. What? Okay. That's Should a level up. The Nintendo oh. eShop right now. Yeah, available in the shop. Congratulations to Nomad Games. Oh, look at you. Oh, I should have grabbed the other one in the other room. Dang. I yeah, wasn't ready about the, like the legit prepared. switch. This I wasn't prepared, dude. Light. Yes, it is now officially available. Oh, look at this, though. I'll put this up. That's the one. Oh, yeah, yeah, right there. Mystic Veil. Vale. Congratulations to Nomad Games, uh, AEG. They got their title up there. Uh, as Nomad told us yesterday, uh, as we played Talisman Digital, Mario now owns, <laughs> now has this in his collection, dude. Now has this in yeah. his collection. Yeah, it's it's a me, Mystic Veil. Vale. It's a me, Mystic Veil vale is now there. So <laughs> congratulations to them and uh, everyone who's a Mystic Veil vale fan. Uh, check it out. It's there in the eShop. Um, has the expansions available for purchase. Um, if you were watching and following Nomad um, the last couple weeks, you saw that there was a week-long chance to pre-purchase it and got 10% off. Um, so if you were a fan and got in on the 10%, bang, but Hey, maybe yep. you didn't, maybe you didn't know Mystic Veil vale Digital was coming to Nintendo switch consoles. Cause you weren't following us. You weren't following Mystic or you weren't following Nomad. You weren't following us. Well, we're going to give away three keys tonight. What? Okay. Three. So we're actually, we're actually giving away two keys tonight and we will do a third giveaway that will last a week. So you, so, so those of you watching on YouTube and those of you catching the, uh, the VOD later, yeah. you can still get on a, on a key. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Sea Otter does clarify that 10% is still available. I was just trying to make our giveaways more awesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Sea Otter, for taking down yeah. my, our giveaway notch. But yes, that's yeah. three years, Sea Otter. So thank you so much. Three keys for three years, Sea Otter. There we go, right three now. Three keys, key four. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yeah, three keys will forge a mystic <laughs> veil key. key, a blue ah. key, a red key. <laughs> yes, we gotta crush that. Um, so yeah, guys, we're, we're excited to play some more Mystic Veil. Vale. If you're not familiar with Mystic Veil, vale, it's the awesome card crafting deck building game from AEG, where we'll be battling out as druids, making yep. sure we don't uh, destroy the lands. Basically, um, looking for awesome combos, beautiful art. Uh, if you saw our first episode of this when we brought it out, um, we were, I think, blown away by exploring yeah, it. I, I, yeah, like, we were, we were, we were very pleasantly surprised with yeah. with the UI and how things looked and how yeah. pretty it was. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Sea Otter saying, I already have my Switch version loaded, so no giveaway for me because it looks like Sea Otter's maybe going to try to take us on tonight. Lyle, I think he's, he's. It's been a while since we since Sea Otter took us on. He's, he's got us in the uh, the the what do you call it, the hex. <laughs> Yeah, the sites. Or I mean, whatever. What's, when was the, what was the last game the you were playing with Sea Otter? Do you think it was it was a small world thing? Was it a choo choo thing? I don't, I don't know. know. But early Sea Otter gets the worm, I guess. You could try to yeah. take us on because the last time we played this, I was a, as I started saying, episode one, we we took on, I believe it was Gareth, and we called him out yesterday. Gareth Miller, producer over at Nomad Games, who we talked to about Talisman Digital joining the Switch mm -hmm. family this week as well, um, and uh, he talked about Mystic Veil vale a bit. He came in here and crushed us in Mystic Vale, along with one of those awesome uh, uh, expansions yeah. we got to dive into. I, got, I gotta tell you, he, it was, it was, he was being real nice because uh, I, he was on our show. <laughs> yeah. But I think if you talk, if you talk to, if you talk to him, uh, not on our show, he probably would have been like, those great guy guys suck and <laughs> destroyed them, man. <laughs> no way, dude. No way. They're such friendly folks across the pond. They're, yeah. they're way too nice. They're lovely people over at Nomad. They've been supporting us, so we're supporting them. Um, and it's been awesome. And these titles look amazing. Um, including Smash Up, another title by Nomad uh, as well, which has been doing uh, pretty good and we can't wait to get back to as well, which will be fun. But, and also from AEG. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. connecting are, the dots yeah, we are we are all completely nomad ag these days <laughs> suddenly yeah the, the, all of a sudden it was like oh, i am and we became yeah. we became one we we evolved yeah. lyle we, well there's a lot of a lot of really fun releases all happening at the same time so it was like it. all right i guess well i guess we're gonna i guess we're gonna have to play some games hey dude how crazy is the universe that we just got switch consoles and we've now done two switch releases this week yeah i know for board games that are digital. I don't know. Is there a coincidence there? Dude, it's crazy. Uh, am I, it's crazy. Am I, are we more in tuned with the Nintendo verse now? I because guess, we dude. actually have them. <laughs> I guess that's what happens. I mean, Nintendo is like, 
It's Mario, dude. Mario owns everything, knows everything that's going on. It's really crazy. Uh, yeah. It's pretty nuts. <laughs> it yeah, pretty don't, nuts. Will, don't tell the American football is the real football. Wow. Oh, wow. Shots fired. Wow. Shots fired. Wow. Um, wow. But yeah, the Switch has been great. The Switch is an awesome console, dude. I, I was talking, uh, I think, a little bit yesterday. Uh, my son, even today, we picked up the NES. Um, it's kind of like the mod. You can play old NES games. There's also the, yep. the Super Nintendo stuff you can do. Um, and he's been like, you know, we own a few Switch games with all the new graphics and new Mario, all that good stuff. But dude, sure. he's been loving uh, diving into the Super Nintendo games. And then today, he took a deep dive into the NES games. So he's nice. in there playing the original Super Mario Bros. He was playing Super Mario 3. And uh, he's, he, uh, what was it? He's, he's playing Donkey Kong, the original Donkey Kong back in NES. He was talking about My Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, I think. He was diving Yo, into Mike Kirby. Yo, Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, nice. Yeah, he was in Kirby. Like, Glass dude, he's in, Joe. he's like in the <laughs> zone, dude. They have like F-Zero. He was playing Excite Bike this morning. Dude, he's like, he's, a, as a six-year-old, I was like, you are going to be the best versed six year old in the game of Earth. They're all CS1! Thank you so much for the epic sub. That's two wheel spins for you. You're looking good today. <laughs> step step behind the velvet rope yeah. for your epic sub. Thank you so much, dude. <laughs> And he says, Nintendo is the best. I suppose you guys are pretty cool, too. Thank you so so much, OCS1, for that. Um, Non-Unique Guy says, nice to hear the younger generation playing classic NES games. Yeah, I mean, the, the idea on the Switch is they have a limited... Um, library that you can play on on the switch yeah. version of the nes stuff uh but the titles are pretty sick i hope they add more and i think they cycle them in and out someone can maybe correct me I'm on that i'm pretty sure that I, I think i heard that they cycle in and out and they're yeah. always adding a little bit more to the library yeah which is pretty cool i mean i'd love for them to put everything up there but yeah sure. i mean it's it's interesting because the controls are just so much easier um on super nintendo not even i mean even an nes and the games yeah. are so much more basic like he was in there playing uh oh, what's it called um it's like the prequel I mean, generally to Street that's kind of what i miss about games sometimes like the yeah. simplicity of controls and, and stuff yeah. like that i mean you give yeah. a you give an xbox one controller to a six-year-old they're like what <laughs> they're like, yeah well These... yeah and then two seconds later they're like better than you but <laughs> oh yeah 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 but i mean an nes controller is just like dude a b and then just run to the to the right <laughs> yeah. like or jump up you know what yeah, i mean jump up um Get that sweet blister on your left thumb. Right, yeah. right, right. Oh, and actually, so I remember a story about a guy who made his kid play through the generations before buying a current console. Yeah, I mean, it is. I mean, in the Switch, going back, and I won't get too, too back into this because we're here to play some Mystic Veil vale tonight, guys. We've got a lot of giveaways to do. We've got even an extra talisman giveaway we're going to do before we start things off from yesterday's giveaways uh, for you guys, for all the board game fans and the Switch hype. Um, but I think it is important and I, I think it's awesome. And the switch is such a great console that it's exposing this new generation to where like Mario came from. Like you could yeah. play through up through everything, you know, or the Zeldas yeah. and stuff, which is sick. Like that's yeah. awesome. Especially, especially if you want the storyline, you know? Oh yeah. If you, yeah. Yeah. You want that, 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 that really sweet storyline. Yeah. Yeah. Princess is not in this castle. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, but but I actually think that's really 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 awesome about that story. OCS one said about like <laughs> the yeah. guy who made his kid play through all of them. It's just like, oh, yeah, it's on a PS four. It's like, <laughs> no, you have no. to appreciate. Here's an Intellivision. You have to appreciate. <laughs> I am bummed though. I have I am bummed. And someone again, if if I'm wrong in saying this, because I looked at it, but I went through it pretty quick. The list of titles for Super Nintendo, the emulate thing has. It doesn't have Donkey Kong Country. Oh, really? Yeah, which oh. I think I did not see Donkey Kong Country in the Super Nintendo games list, which I was like, oh, and that's what I know he would really enjoy because that was a great game for Super Nintendo. It looked amazing uh, yeah, back yeah, in the yeah. day. It's freaking great. But well, guys, we're here to play some Mystic Veil vale because it's now on Nintendo Switch as well. Let's join that family. Whoa. Whoa. So guys, go pick it up um, if you enjoy Mystic Veil. Vale. Uh, it's It looks amazing. We're about to play, play it for you here. We will take on campers. I think we'll limit it to one camper joining us per game uh, just because we don't want to take two too long um yep. and we're just gonna move move things along there and then we'll jump into another game we'll just kind of go through it throughout the night uh nomad games may make an appearance um tonight as well i mean i know it's they're over in the uk so it's uh yeah. so it's, there are they, i mean there's like six hours ahead of me five hours ahead of you yeah so it's like right? four in the morning three in the morning almost four in the morning there right now yep. i believe uh so they they may jump in because they're crazy over there they're celebrating they're out popping bottles off lorries popping bottles in the ice <laughs> on like lorries Lou, lorries i guess in the loo i don't know like, i'm trying to think of the british terms here like oh with biscuits God. i don't know like, and tea <laughs> i don't know popping tea off they're popping off the tea 
<laughs> but they're sitting there having a blast celebrating. And again, congratulations to them. So if they pop in, they may be answering questions and all that good stuff. And uh, we appreciate you guys as a community always helping the new players to the game um, as well as us because we're going to be experiencing some of the expansions for the first time we haven't used for the first time. So we'll do our best to show it off, uh, make it look uh, fun because we're going to have some fun. Like <laughs> we have fun, but if you have any questions of what we're doing, we're going to kind of move through it. Um, yeah. Lyle, anything more to to add to the Mystic Veil hype tonight? Mystic Veil hype? Uh, not, nothing else to add, I guess, with the Mystic Veil hype. You know, just just a reminder, guys. We are gonna we're gonna finish up this uh, this giveaway for Talisman Digital. Yeah, let's uh, do it. You right get now. to choose whether you want a Steam or a Switch key. You That's just right. let us know if you win. Uh, but this is the last chance for you guys to get in on this key giveaway because we're about to. I'm gonna I will open up the next giveaway immediately for mystic veil digital right and so when that thing's running we'll uh we'll give that away we'll run another giveaway we'll give that away and then at the very end we will we will run a week-long one so so that's that's all the hype that's going on right now a yeah. lot of giveaways right now so you should feel lucky if you're tuning in yeah you're gonna you, so yeah if you missed our talisman digital stream yesterday that game is fun man and there's a ton of expansions and like lyle said you can choose switcher or steam for it the other awesome thing is because on the Switch version of Talisman Digital, not to rewind back Talisman Days, um, which was yesterday, uh, and it came out on Monday, but they are actually matching what came out on the Switch. So it comes with three of the expansions for Talisman Digital. Um, they gave us a base key, but they said if you if, if it's requested, or if it probably would, they will match the Switch version because the Switch comes with them. The Steam version won't. But if you get if you want the Steam key, they'll give you a key code to get the three expansions for Talisman Digital. Just let us know if you want yeah. Steam or Switch. And that also goes, Lyle, I believe, for Mystic Veil, vale, that they can get us um, Switch keys for Mystic Veil, vale, right? Is that true? I believe it's by okay. request. Be okay, by request. Okay, yeah. so so we have Steam keys to give away to you guys. So if you if you want it immediately, immediately. yeah. Uh, we can give you a, we can give you Steam key, but if you are if you're looking for a Switch key, we can get back to you. Yeah. On that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It'll, it might take a little bit longer, but the Steam keys will get to you immediately. So right now, Lyle, let's fire off these wheel spins because the people maybe want some more crits so they can get in some Talisman Digital. Buy your tickets right now, guys! Exclamation point ticket um, buys you your first ticket. It's free. Subs get two times luck. And if you type exclamation point ticket space and the number of tickets you want, you can get in on Talisman Digital before more giveaways happen. What? What? So let's fire off that first wheel spin, Lyle, to get this people. was for the sea otter. For the sea otter, thank you so much, sea otter. And the yeah. three years, for the three years, oh. and I just want to, I, because sea otter reminded me because he's he's uh, he lives in St. Louis. I uh, Casey and I may or may not be getting to St. Louis anymore. Oh, uh, 20 push-ups for me. 20 push-ups for Lyle. Twist. Uh, because Safari Zone St. Louis was canceled. Uh, yeah. and that was not this weekend, but next weekend. Yeah. Um. So. There's a chance that we're still going because we still we're, we saw family over there, right. um, but and and because we were supposed to go over there to see family and also see a soccer game, but as you know, all professional sports are now getting canceled. Um, so you know, I Savage, it, it's, it, yeah, it, it, there might not be a reason to go. <laughs> Super sucks. Super sucks. Yeah, dude. and so, uh, and there's a there's a state of emergency here in Tennessee, so we might not even be able to leave. You know, so yeah. we'll see. So, and OCS, uh, just wow, we're the, the wheel three times. times. So, guys, let's keep these wheels going, dude. So, he so has, that's five. That's five wheel spins for OCS. We're gonna do five wheel spins right here for OCS one. This can win you guys more crits right here. So, big thanks to OCS one Specter for all the support, man. Yeah. Um, let's fire that off. Uh, big time, big time hype here. So, get yeah, giveaways, giveaways, giveaways to get excited about Nomads games coming out on Nintendo Switch, man. But get get it get it in there, dude. Get it in there. Getting rich. The OCS one. He's balling in the club. Makes it, it rain. rain. Just speaking of, um, I, sports aren't necessarily canceled. I've heard just the fans aren't allowed to go to a lot of the like March Madness games, but they may be changing all around. I mean that by yeah. I mean, well, I know I know that the NBA, the NFL, and the MLS all of have suspended their games. Oh really? Oh okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's um, not. And, oh, then, and then yeah, and, it. I, and I believe. Yeah, March Madness. They're still playing the games, but there's no no people. Yeah, it's no so people. nuts, dude. It's so nuts. Yeah, it's so nuts. It's, it's it's a crazy world out there, guys. But hey, it is a crazy world. Oh, bean for Lyle. Eat up on those. Oh, those a bean. I'm getting wrecked. You know what they haven't discovered yet? That the cure for this virus are bean boozled beans, dude. A bean boozled beans. It's and, probably and we've been building up immunity, like IOK powder. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I just think if people eat lots of the like dishwater ones, maybe that's what'll say like clear it. <laughs> 
because it's just there's got to be some weird chemical in there what a bright side of mike how you doing my dude oh right side of mike it's been a long time he says nhl has canceled now too Our so, brother's in the so that's confirmed nhl see uh, see otter says ncaa has canceled all tournaments March. Oh, yep. really? It's all done now. Oh, and Gimmicker wow. says, as of an hour ago, March Madness is suspended. So. Dude, do, 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 yep, breaking, breaking news. Breaking sports news. We're breaking sports news and, and opening up Twitch uh, Switch things. Let's spin the wheel again, man, because we're busting right, these yeah. We got Yeah, we got two more spins after this. We're, we're hyping up OCS 1 Spectre with all these spins, and uh, we're just going over. <laughs> but we have to say, hanging out at the camp, Lyle and I have been saying this, is a safe way to play board games, because we yeah. won't get you sick. We can't get you sick. Oh, and it's a bean for me. That's a bean for you. That's a bean for each of us. We have two more. I'll get a bean while you get a bean. This will make you sick. That'll make you sick. That's the All right. But yeah, hey, I mean, it's this is a good time to get board games on the Switch, man. Um, I think this is peach or barf. This is a uh, bugger or juicy pear. All right, cheers. Bottom two more win. Two more wheels. Right two here. more wheels. Then I got. I got peach. I got. I got. I got pear. Oh, you got pear. I got pear. Mm -hmm. Love it. Yeah, Mike, how's everything Whoa. to the north, man? I hope they, oh, we got Kung Fu Hippie joining the house. Oh, Kung Fu Hippie. Thank you so much for the reset. What, what is that? Oh, Kung Fu Hippie covered it. It's a make it rain. Oh, it's a make it rain for this more coins yep. for get on the giveaway, guys. Like we said. In those two make it rains, that's five tickets, guys, for the giveaway. That's five tickets. That's five right, tickets. We have one more spin for OCS and then one spin for Kung Fu Hippie. Woo! Don't forget, guys. Thank you so much, Kung Fu Hippie, for that uh, eight-month streak there, man. Freaking yeah. great. Um, I don't forget the Talisman Digital Stream is open right now. The giveaway is open still right now, so you can buy tickets right now before we move on to the next giveaway. Oh, nice! What is going on? All right, let's spin the wheel for Kung Fu Hippie to see if it's another bean before I throw. Okay, throw let's do that. Kung Fu Hippie. Lyle's gonna do some beans. Yeah. Um, so enter now. Enter now if you want to try to win a copy of the Talisman Digital, or if you're just saving up your crits for the Mystic Veil giveaways. Like we said, we'll be doing three Mystic Veil giveaways today. Oh, oh. Man. All right, so Chris, you're up to 55 burpees. Oh, savage. That's um, a, that's I a have hit. 20 push-ups and a bean to do, so let me do this bean. I'm at 75 burpees? 55. Okay, 55. <laughs> Thank you. 55. And, uh, of course, this one is the old birthday cake or dirty dishwater. That, that is, is the great. cure. That is this the is cure. Wonderful. That one kills Oh, speaking everything. of which, I got my dishwasher fixed, finally. Oh. That was great. Awesome. Nice. I've had, I've had a guy look at my HVAC system. I've had an electrician and I've had a plumber at my house in the last three days. It's been wonderful. That's, that's, uh, that's good. <laughs> oh. And when it tastes like it, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I need to get innocent. <laughs> oh, here. yes. The other cure for all things. When you're, when yeah. you're locked up in your house, this is what you need to go. People are loading up on toilet paper and yes, everything. If like you are, if, yeah. This is what you need. Listen, if you are if you are self isolating right now, it, it's it's no excuse to to not be hydrated. Not to okay? be it, to not be so innocent. You, you should be you should be hydrated <laughs> and innocent. To not be innocent, you need to stay innocent while wireless isolated and playing board games on the internet digitally, like Mystic Veil vale on the Switch and Talisman Digital. Lyle, let's draw the winner for Talisman Digital, guys. Get in on it right now. Time okay. is ticking. I am. Uh, yeah. Let's see. I'm going to close. I see some last minute. People got in here. We were going to close the giveaway in about five, five seconds. Okay. Four, Talisman three, digital. Talisman digital. Two, oh my gosh. One. It is closed, guys. It is Talisman closed. Is closed. You can no longer enter this giveaway. We are drawing the winner right now. It is Mr. Mr. Draco. Draco. That's freaking awesome. Congratulations, man. Reach out to not in chat. Mr. Draco, Mr. Draco, Mr. Draco. Congratulations, Mr. Draco, if you're here. You don't have to be present to win these guys, but congratulations on the long run uh, yeah. giveaway. We'll be doing that. Was for Talisman Digital guys. Uh, That's for Talisman Digital. Uh, he won with a 55.25% chance to win. He was the only person to go completely all in on this giveaway. Dude, Sean did too he on the first other one. So boom. <laughs> so right on. Congratulations, dude, and thanks you okay. guys for all your support and everyone entering. Baker, I, I gotta tell you, like. I don't hate on Topo Chico. I, I actually drink a lot of Topo Chico as Topo well. Topo Chico? I don't know yeah. Topo Chico. What is Topo Chico? Sparkly mineral water, dude. It, it's it's also very good. I, I don't hate on Topo Chico. Is there uh is there salt in it? Sodium? Oh, I, I don't. It's just it's delicious. That's what I know. It's oh, good. Okay. All right. Well, but I, but I mean for, for me, you know, <laughs> the voice of a new generation. <laughs> right here the way of self-isolation <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh. i do yeah i do like a topo chico though mm. 
All right. So uh, that means I have to I have to get this giveaway started. So yeah. So guys, check out. So we just wrapped up Talisman Digital Hype. Please check that out on the Switch as well. Uh, also made by Nomad. It's a lot of fun. There's so many expansions, so many characters, so much good stuff. And we're going to be doing a lot more content with it because it's never ending. Um, you can RP in it. And it's just a lot of fun. And it can be an RNG fest. Sometimes it's a grind, but um, it's it's a game right up our alley. I know some people were kind of like, oh, it's too much for me. I can't take the grind. But what if you go back and watch our episode from yesterday? The way that game ends is so ridiculous. Yeah, I don't want to spoil it. It, it was, was so it was great. Amazing. Yeah, I recommend going to watch it, guys. Also, we did an awesome yeah. interview with Gareth, who's the producer of this game as well, Gareth Miller from Nomad Games. Um, we talked to him a little bit about um, the hype going on over there with this. So uh, Lyle's going to open up the first giveaway for Mystic Veil vale soon. There it is. It is open um, right there. So to get in on this giveaway, uh, you can do exclamation point giveaway in chat. It'll give you a link straight to stream elements. If you want to enter in chat, you buy tickets via crits. And your ter and your first ticket is free as long as you're a follower of the camp. So if you just want to get that one ticket, that's free. Exclamation point ticket in, ca in chat. Yep. And you'll get it. Yep. You'll get confirmation that you got it. If you want to buy more tickets, check your crits. Buy exclamation point crits in chat. Each ticket costs 10 crits with a 100 ticket maximum. So if you want to go all in, that's 1,000 crits that you'll need. Um, you'll be gaining crits by watching us. You get you get crits by following us. If you're a sub, you get two times luck in this giveaway. Um, yeah, and if you you know throw us bits and stuff, you like over a hundred, you'll get some bonus crits on that, and yeah. we'll give you some crits as we play the game too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, if the camp beats us, you get bonus crits to root on your fellow campers. If they're taking us on, as Mati Games says, Mary Vale Max Miss <laughs> one and all. Mary Vale Miss. Oh, do I, do I have that ready? Oh yeah. Oh. Oh, One and all. Oh, um, but, I, but I didn't actually finish my little thing. If you want to buy multiple tickets, it's exclamation point ticket. Singular. Singular. Space how many tickets you want to buy. So if you want to buy tickets, it's 10 tickets. It's exclamation point ticket space 10. If you have 100 crits. There you go. <laughs> Wait, I think we spent half our stream describing that phrase. <laughs> like, I know. I hate that? the stupid singular thing. I wish I wish we could just change it. But stream elements, it just that's just the way it is. Oh, and then my favorite was yesterday when we were like, it was, it was that yeah. the one guy Dozo? He was just like, oh, okay. So oh, he was like, I, I exclamation swear. point tickets. And we're like, <laughs> no, singular. And he's like, exclamation point ticket, and no space, like one. <laughs> just like, every no, iteration. Sorry, yeah. you, have to, you have to put a space uh, there. <laughs> savage. So savage. So savage. So good luck to everyone, man. Get in on this. Like we said, this is courtesy of Nomad Games. Um, and uh, yeah, you got a chance to win the Steam key for it, even though we're doing it here. But if you have a Switch and you'd like it on the Switch, just t we'll talk to you about it and we'll put in a request for you to try to get you a Switch key. They're uh, from Nintendo. They're just, it's Nintendo. So it's a little bit harder to get those keys sometimes, even for Nomad who made the game because it's Nintendo. Um, not to say Nintendo's bad. They're just a little bit tighter with their keys than Steam is. <laughs> Steam gives away all their product. Nintendo does not give away all their product. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why? Because Nintendo owns everything. <laughs> um, you need to make a command for tickets to tell people to use ticket. I think we do. It's in the giveaway command. <laughs> I think yeah, it's straight it's in the up giveaway in the giveaway command. Yeah, it's in the giveaway command. Isn't it? Yeah, yeah. the giveaway command is just like Type so. Ticket. Yeah. Number two. <laughs> it's it's <all> right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but if we need to do that too we'll do that too if if ocs1 you know you got that epic sub you're in behind the velvet rope if you request it we'll do it what we actually need to do is probably put like uh like yeah an obs like text box that we just like put on the screen every now and then is that's just like right. exclamation point ticket we, we could put it in the um the want. same thing we do with the inked gaming thing you know what i mean yeah. we should do it there yeah. look at this guys uh yeah yeah like i mean if we if we ever do this right here like this whoop. so we yeah. can put it in one of those for you guys and uh, you'd get it. But it, if we're not running a giveaway, people would be all confused. Ah, whatever. Now we're yeah, doing yeah, production yeah, stuff. Yeah. We need to get into uh, we need to get into uh, Mystic Veil, vale, man. We're here to play some Mystic Veil. Vale, so let's show this game off. Uh, we're really excited. Once again, this game is put out physically by AEG. They just came out with another new expansion physically, not digitally yet. There's three expansions currently available digitally. Um, I forget what the mechanic is of the newest physical expansion, uh, but it looks sick. I haven't played it. Don't own it. Um, yep. But definitely check it out we're if you're a fan. Base. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, but we're we're going to be diving into some of the new, uh, from some of the expansions currently available for the digital version. All of it's available on the Switch as well. You just have to purchase them after the base game, um, based on what you want to do. I will recommend that if you're looking for something a little bit broader of a game, that you do buy at least one expansion for it. Uh, the base game is fun. It's beautiful. It's a, it's it's cool. Um, but it's very basic in terms of an easy to access card crafting deck builder. Um, yeah. so if you're not a deck builder fan, but you want to jump into this, the card crafting thing, the beauty of it, the base game, you'll be psyched. 
but I think if you want a little bit more, get at least one expansion. Um, and yeah, uh, it, I, I, it'll take. Yeah. Care. So basically, what happened was Chris and I played the base game uh, physically once, and we were like, "Oh, we can see, you know, like this could be fun." And and the whole card crafting thing is interesting mechanic of like actually sleeving and unsleeving cards and stuff like that. But after we finished our first game, we were just kind of like. We were like, if we play another game, I feel like it's going to be the exact same game that we just played. Um, but and then um, and then adding in an expansion actually just changes a lot of the stuff. So so adding the expansion just really makes it feel like it has more legs. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a good idea. OCS one has a good thing about the tickets thing. What about uh, if someone types would be it wrong? Better because when someone types it wrong, automatically tells them so you man. don't have to. Oh, I see. I see man, OCS one, you smart man. You next smart, level. That's man. why you're an epic he's, sub. Dude. He's like, yeah, oh. he's, yeah. Why don't we listen to him more, dude? Well, I yeah, we should. He's like, in the, he's in that special room, dude. You know, I know. Well, he's in that special room, and we don't even get to go in that special room. Yeah, <laughs> so I know. You got to step out of that room sometimes, man. All right. <laughs> so uh, let's get into this, guys, uh, and let's start exploring it. Let's start exploring it. Like we said, this is crop plat, or I don't know if we said clarified, but this is cross platform, by the way. Yeah. So we're gonna be going on to online multiplayer. Uh, we're gonna create a game. It's going to be called Crit Camp. Okay, space. No, it's just one word. Crit Camp. Crit Camp. Um, and we're going to jump in here. Like we said, we're kind. Of, we're going to kind of try to limit it to three campers. Um, we'll do standard pool size. Uh, turn time is off. Sea Otter's in. And what did we play with before? Lyle's going to hop in here. Sea Otter was ready to go, dude. Oh, Crit oh Camp. Oh my gosh. Yeah, Crit Camp is the name. Okay. So Moscow. To, so let's try the Veil of Magic. I think. We did Mana Storm last time, right? I feel like we did Mana Storm, yeah. So we're not really super familiar with these expansions. I don't. I can't really click to find no, out. We what are we not. Mean. We are not familiar with these expansions. So I'm going <laughs> to choose one, and then we're going to explore it together. I think that's the best way to do this, yeah. huh? Yeah, let's so, do it. Sea Otter, welcome to the game, my friend. And three years, I wish you luck, sir. We're going to get crushed. Yeah. And here we go, guys. We are now in Mystic Vale, the beauty that is. The Digital Mystic that Veil. Is, turn up the audio. Uh, Mystic Veil. And look at this. I am. Uh, it's me. It's a me, so, uh, Mario. So just to clarify what's going on here, Lyle's going to be the green tab here. He's um he's Hidden Leaf Village, in this yep. one. Uh, in, what am I? How do I know what I am? Oh, I'm blue. I'm Water Village or whatever that was from Naruto. And then Sea Otter is going to be red, dude. He's he's super red village man. So he's second. All right. I have two. I have two bucks. Now, Lyle, we added an expansion. Yep. Um, we, what is the expansion? Like, what is the what 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 got added? Do you know? <laughs> we just randomly threw on the first one that was in the list. It wasn't Mana Storm, and it wasn't oh uh, the Wild one. It was the other one. The, the Veil of the Wind or whatever. Yeah. Did anyone catch which uh, expansion we just threw in? Because I kind of was <laughs> I gonna thought, look. I thought up. it was gonna like give us a like a little like yeah tutorial. This is what's new in this expansion. Veil of Magic. Veil so, of Magic. Yeah. I'm gonna quickly. Know... I'm gonna quickly go. <laughs> this is bad uh mystic yeah. veil ve yeah. uh, veil of magic expansion right mystic veil veil of magic like yeah like what what's new here on mystic veil veil of magic yeah i just wanted to make sure we didn't get uh veil of magic all right so what does it do um <laughs> uh, so the veil of innovative card crafts good good blah, 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 beautiful artwork is uh adds a new advancement and veil cards to the base veil magic veil game giving players more card crafting options exceeding new possibilities so it just added a whole bunch of okay new just added cards. new cards okay. yeah which is perfect this is perfect okay okay this is great okay all right so so i'm first i don't know if i'll push um i don't have enough information about pushing yeah. but and what's so let's take what a look at some of these once maturity if you were to spoil you may discard your on deck card instead Ooh, i think i need just need bucks look in the at beginning this squirrel dude. so yeah this oh. is a new card huh I don't uh, know if they're described. The cards aren't. So look at this ether tree, Lyle. Oh my gosh. If you were to spoil, you may discard this card to cancel all whatever effects on one card. If that is not yeah, from dude. a cursed land. Oh my okay. gosh. We're just going to, we're going to skip to our harvest phase. We're just going to grab some soil, dude. Um, dude. And then we're going to end our turn. After, after what getting wrecked by Gareth uh, from Nomad, I'm kind of like, money's important. <laughs> Yeah, money. Yeah, money is important, dude. This game, guys, is all about combinations and finding something oh, like that amazing he took combination. Field of flowers, dude. He took field of flowers. He's getting rich, dude. Yeah, that's pretty nuts. I'm gonna turn this down just a bit, guys. Getting the level here. Yeah. Um. All right. It's water. Yo, look how many blanks. Look at look wow. how many cards you drew on your field, bro. Dude, next level, please. So I'm at four bucks right off the bat, my man. 
canopy explorer. Oh, and again, guys, if we're moving a little quick into this game, please ask questions if you're not familiar with how this game works. We're basically crafting cards within sleeves, gaining mana, and looking for combinations to make the cards in our deck. We all start with the same deck to make our decks better than the other people's deck based on the marketplace that's available. Yep. All right. If you guys have any questions, please ask. For each shield in this card that makes cards on top of your deck, put, well, place that many cards from the top of your deck at the end of your field. Is wow. that good? What if they're I don't bad? know, man. That seems risky. This, the Canopy Explorer says this is the way. <laughs> yeah, this, this is the yeah. That's the way. Oh, the music stopped again. Um, it'll come back. You may discard any other card in your field when played. Um, maybe I'm just gonna get two Fertile Soils or a Peacekeeper Druid. Yeah, what you gonna do, man? I think I'm gonna Peacekeeper Druid and Fertile Soil, man, because that seems pretty good, right? Yeah. Sea Otter says Canopy Explorer adds cards during the harvest, so it, you would be safe. It's not during the planting phase. Planting phase is when you bust. Okay. Oh, so it just throws them into the mix. Dude, that's pretty good. But you have to get a whole... You have to go mad. I need money, dude. Yeah. I need money. So, Gimmicker, I, I, I'll, I'll tell you right now that... How do I buy things? It is very fiddly. Um, oh. Physically. Yeah, but if if you are very into sleeving cards and you find that cathartic, the, yeah, the game is really nice. But the the setup and 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 uh, disassembly of your game is kind of annoying. The the what's nice about the digital version is the bookkeeping that happens is is automated, right? So you know you can easily see how much mana you have and how many symbols you have and where your opponents are and how much victory points are left. It's it's you don't have to keep track of that yourself. Right. Looks like I got three bucks next turn. I went Peacekeeper Druid, dude. I think dude, this music will start up. I only have two bucks. You start with how many uh, spoil? What's that? How much spoil do you do you start with? Nine? I think it was nine. I think nine total in terms of spoil. Yeah, and you can check your discard or okay, whatever, we're right? pushing. Pushing? So you can push for okay. more. Yeah, the music hopefully will start uh, back up again, guys. <laughs> we, we, we had this bug before. Um, Nomad is aware of it. Right. And we'll I go got up. three bucks. It's super, super intense. Deadwood now. Harvester. You may discard any other card in your field. I dig the Deadwood, dude. Nine Cursed Lands. So Sea Otter says nine Cursed Lands, eight blank, and three Fertile Soil. Yeah, yeah, nine Cursed Lands. Yep, that's what I thought. Yeah. Cancel all but one on this card. Ceiling's interesting. I, you know what? I, I think I still need to... Look at this seedling, dude. Cancel all yeah. but one on this card. Ooh. All right, we're pushing... Well, that's, I mean, that's maybe not great, actually. What are you pushing for, dude? Trying to get lucky? Pushing. I wish the music would come Oh, back. spoiled. Spoiled! Yeah. So Lyle loses everything, and he gets a bonus man at the start of his next turn. Yeah. All right, over to Sea Otter. When's the music coming back? When's the band going to start up? <laughs> okay, we got <laughs> yo, Fertile Soil. Yo, where's the band, dude? Where's the band, dude? Nomad, where's the band? I think the band fell asleep. All right, so I got three. Um, you spoiled, uh, so you only got one. So, ooh. What's, there's no one cost. Got fertile soil. Damn it. Um, mm, I think it's just uh, this Deadwood Harvester. Interesting. When played, you made Deadwood Harvester is pretty good. Yeah, Deadwood Harvester is pretty sick. Uh, I wouldn't say he's sick. I think he's pretty all right. I think it's okay, dude. It's pretty sick, bro. <laughs> Okay, I gotta move out of my planting phase. I'm not gonna push. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put it uh, on this empty boy here. Put on an empty boy. Put, pay the money. Pay the man his money. Pay the man his money. Over to Lyle. Looks like uh, I got okay. a, a play next bucks. turn. I got bucks now. How did you get bucks? I just I it just flipped over nicely. Like yeah, but don't don't you lose I can your? Get a, I can get a ooh. I could get a. So wait, you spoiled. It's very. This is the most intense game of Mystic Veil because we have no music right now. <laughs> yeah, no. So I spoiled, so that gave me my mana a mana token for the next turn. So yeah. I I show four of my field, but I have an extra one. So I have I have five. Um, I might get this Water Weaver, dude. Dang, dude. Is that five if you want, or if you don't use that mana, it's gone. I think if you don't use that mana, it's gone. Yeah, I kind of like this Water Weaver, dude. It's a Mando. Plus a, v a VP, plus a on play VP. A water weaver right here. Yeah. Whoa. Intense. 
See, without the music, you can really hear this. Uh, you can really hear this. Uh, these yeah, it's sound water effects, time. <laughs> Did your music stop too? My music? Yeah. I, I turn off my music oh, because you hear usually mine. have your music on. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 the minute you get from spoiling, you keep until you spend it. Right. Oh, so I could have kept it. Okay. Yeah. Well, okay. that's that's that's, that's quick news, everybody. It's rollover minutes, dude. Rollover minutes. It's rollover. Thank you, Sea Otter. Awesome. Let's know for next time. Oh, here's that hawk, dude. Hawk's back. Oh, hawk. yeah, hawk. All right, he's at four. I don't know about this seedling, man. Okay, he's going to go with a four. I think seedling's all right. If he takes what? hawk, dude, that's going to be pretty savage. Hawk is so good. Come well, on. I mean, it gives you a curse, though, so it's it's like... Yeah, but you could seedling, man. But you get two VP. I don't know. <laughs> like, oh, he's a canopy, oh, dude. Oh, he did canopy on a blank. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Pays of Flynn, what is the main objective of this game? First time seeing it, hard to keep up. Okay, so the main uh, objective is to get the most uh, VP at the end, right here, um, which 28. are represented on the on the bottom right of the screen, these blue and these gray sort of tallies. Um, and so you want to end the game um, with the most. And so this number 28 big tally right now is like the amount of VP that's available to grab from all of us. Um, and so if you, if whenever we play a card with a blue sort of shield on it, we sort of take away from that number and it's sort of a countdown. Um, and then the gray VP we have don't come out of that. It's just VP that's, that's calculated at the very end. Yeah. So whoever, as soon as that peel pool depletes, the game ends, right? Yep. Yep. And that's what you're doing. So you're trying to grab cards to get there the fastest, basically. Yeah, and then to buy buy things from the marketplace, you need this like blue mana token stuff. Um, and then when you That's are dot on the card, yeah, this when you have here. your turn, uh, basically what happened is, yeah, I'm currently winning <laughs> with one and one one end game VP. That's that's true. So two of these three are cursed. <laughs> so I think I'm at two. I think I've got two bucks this turn. Anything yeah, you've you have flipped bucks, over is it. what you have to use. So I'm going to move yeah. on. Um, I'm just gonna take this and uh, I'm gonna get some fertile soil, my man. Fertile soil, fertile All right, soil, get some money. Easy turn, easy turn. All so right, you're so always. I have all right. So my deck reset. So face of Flynn, yeah, you're basically always playing on your opponent's turn. You're kind of always onto your next turn while your opponents are going during what they call the the uh, planting phase. So right now, like we, Sea Otter already knows he's gonna have four mana based on his cards he turned here before he drew the third red dot, which would be spoil. That's this red dot here. He could then play that out and push and spoil himself and lose his turn, but he may start buying cards up here to counter that. So you're kind of, you all start the same, and then you find ways to sort of find strategies and combos. Yeah. Do I push? So Lyle's currently showing three mana. He's pushing to gain a fourth. If the okay, card's I on deck, it doesn't fourth. count. Ooh, push this can't be explored for each mando on this card place that any cards on top of your deck in your field I still yeah, that's pretty seen, good i haven't seen the power the hawk this, though the yeah, hawk is awesome oh music came back thank god i guess the I last track the ended hawk, finally dude? feels so much better now i got the hawk do i grab this wellspring wellspring is great because like, it just gives you world tree of course Straight face. up um if you go to that, there's that command right there, Mystic Veil, it'll tell you more like it. No DCs like in Talisman, Lyle. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this hawk is so good. So these symbols here, for anyone watching, this paw, those are called elements, I believe. And you Yeah, I'm actually going to grab this. Uh, I'm actually going to grab a wellspring here. Ooh, so we grab the wellspring, which gives him two yeah. elements, this leaf yeah. and this paw element when he turns it over. And those allow you to buy the cards at the top of the screen here. These are things that kind of sit and do constant abilities on your side of the board or are worth points at the end of the game. All right, Sea Otter, what are you doing with your four Yep, bucks? and Sea Otter says you're only able to buy a max of two advancements and two veils each turn. Yeah, the, the unless, cards at the top are veils. Yeah. Cards at the top are veils. Yeah. Okay, he's going with his four dollars, four dollar dollar. Oh, just four dollar dollar. He's going double soil, man. Soil, right? He's he go just getting... double soil. Okay, D double soil. All right. Okay. I think I've got a good soil build going. It's okay. It's mulch season. It is mulch season. Well, actually, it's uh, mulch season was like January, February. Okay, so I'm at the I end. I guess it's mulch season. So I could push here and hope for something because right at the moment, right now you have two bucks. I only have two bucks, and I'm falling behind. This is this yeah. is pleb. I'm pushing. 
Ooh. Okay, so I have nine. No, I have six. So I actually have a good chance of not getting one. Yeah. You want that buck? Or does the buck stop here? Dude, I <laughs> want it. What does this grassland do? When in your field you have one... Oh, and this is the tree. This is so good. Oh, but you sack a tree for a buck. Yeah. I kind of want hawk, man. Maybe. Go for it. No! Spoiled. Oh, spoiled. Maybe no. you can get it next year. <laughs> oh, I got wrecked. So when you spoil, you lose everything you've accumulated and you gain a bonus mana for the next round. Dude, that's awful. All right, I don't think I'm going to push. <laughs> I think I have three. Pushing would be really nice, though. So I can get two soils. Is it worth? I went too hard. My feet? I got too close to the sun. Ooh, nice. Dude, you're so lucky, dude. Oh, yeah, we're going to harvest. We're gonna you, harvest. Were, you were seriously the luckiest guy in this game. Am I Am I the luckiest guy? You are. Am I just good? What are you going to get? You're going to get this. You can get this hawk, dude. I'm so sad if you get the hawk. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is... <sighs> Canopies? No, I think I need to... Uh... Get some soil. Just buy some pledge soil, throws it in here. And yeah, once a card is full, guys, you can never no longer add stuff to it. Unless yeah. you get a card that'll like said you can do that. Oh my god, look at that turn, dude. Dude, what? Your next turn is out of control. Oh yeah, baby. So he he didn't have any other So he's looking for more helmets on this canopy explorer, guys, to trigger this bottom ability. Yeah. Um so right now it doesn't do it does maybe one, I guess. So I, I guess, I guess he gets one extra card. Yeah, he automatically it. gets one from, from this canopy. Yeah. He's for itself. From the top of his deck. All right, he gets soiled. Well, he soiled himself. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, you have, uh, you have four bucks. I have four dollars. Yeah. And five with my, my bonus, right? Or is that no, four? No, 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 you have three bucks or four with, with the bonus. Okay, so active... Active spoil, I think, means one, two, three are in my discard. Plus four, five, six, I'm showing. So technically, there's only three out of 11 cards left. <sighs> I hate the cards I'm showing right now. Yeah. Like, I don't want this hawk on this on this leftmost card because what a waste. Because that's a that's a Mando. Mm -hmm, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah. Uh, yeah, what you gonna do, man? Oh, this hawk and this canopy. Exp oh. Okay, what else is in here? If I get this hulking thorn hide, oh, this heartwood healer with five. If I could get one more mana, dude, I could get her and she could save me. She's my savior. This heartwood healer. Look at her. Oh, she's so healing. Which healer? Oh, the heartwood healer. Yeah, yeah. I'm going for it. Yes. Bam, Heartwood Healer time. You're mine. Oh, wait. Let's harvest yeah. this. Yeah, yeah, I was like, push the right button, man. Oh, I'm Don't clicking, push again. I'm clicking. I'm not taking it. Oh, so healed on, dude. Yeah, healed on. <laughs> there nice. we go. Got her. Pushed for it. Yep. Yeah. And got it. Actually worked yeah. out. What happened? Yeah. Oh, this is me. Oh, I got my Deadwood Harvester. When played, you may discard any card in your field. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's an easy choice. Oh my gosh. Whoa, whoa, oh my whoa, gosh. Whoa, whoa, oh my gosh. Whoa. Oh my gosh. I'm nuts now. Dude, what just happened there? Deadwood Harvester just went off. Okay. We have six out of six. Okay. If I push, I just, I re all I do is reset my deck. Okay. Oh, Peace Creeper Druid so doesn't trigger don't until I spoil. Push. Okay. Good to know. Okay. What's Lyle doing here? He had a nuts turn too. Okay. We have the Hulking Thorn Hide, which is what? Uh, a curse and a, and a bam. A curse and a bam, yeah. But yeah. That's a wild <laughs> yeah. element, I believe. That means wild. I really want this combo. Or no, that's not wild. Like that's that. sun. I think it's like a sun. Yeah, the a, wild it's, element it's is sun. this rainbowy one. This, this uh, looks like Naruto symbol. Yeah. <laughs> it's the okay. ramen symbol. It's I the, think it's we're the, gonna uh, grab the fish. The fish cake symbol. <laughs> or what do they call that thing in ramen? The fish. Fish puck. Fish cake. Is it fish cake? I think it is it's fish cake. Fish cake. Yeah. Um, do I want this canopy explorer? Canopy explorer cake. could be interesting. Little fish cake symbol. 
little fish cakes. Uh, or I could just get two soils. Am I really gonna do that? I oh, think I am. The music ended again. I know the music. I don't know what's going on, dude. Oh, oh, next track start. Oh. This is Madi with his Wait, pan what's flute. What's this one? Water Weaver. Okay, right. so dude, I got six mana next turn, and I have my Peacekeeper Druid I could push with. Oh my gosh, we have to the next turn, next turn. We're going to do that. We're going to do that. What did you buy? Do... I just bought Fertile Soil, dude. Okay. You get yeah, soil? I, I, think I, I think I still need money. You're just soiling yourself, okay. You're technically winning with two VP right now. He has one. Yeah, I know, dude. Yeah. And one. I'm, the I'm gray, a front runner right now, dude. The gray are like Ascension VP, front guys. Runner. They're your card values. The gray amounts here in the bottom right corner. Count at the end. Oh, he pushed. Okay, okay. somebody spoiled. Oh, did he spoil? Oh! Dude, I think somebody... I think somebody... Uh, somebody. Right there, dude. Somebody got greedy. <laughs> Uh-oh, Sea Otter. <laughs> sea Otter's all like... I'll play this game all the time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so... So I got, yeah. <laughs> so this Peacekeeper Druid won't trigger unless I try to spoil, right? Uh, Peacekeeper Druid, once per turn, if you were to spoil, you may discard your on-deck card. Yeah. So I could push harder. Yeah, you could, yeah, you could, you could push and then that's, that's but then basically what happens is you discard your on-deck card and you get a new on-deck card. So it's still, it's still risky. I've done that. I've lived that life. Yeah. I've lived that life, Lyle, and it was... Uh, I know. The Peacekeeper Druid lives lives their life one quarter mile at a time. That is a dangerous so, life. It is. Dude, I'm kind of wanting to go canopy or start setting up maybe this hawk for this canopy explorer. Yeah. Oh. While Chris is thinking about his turn, I want to remind everybody, uh, exclamation point giveaway in chat. We have a current giveaway for this game right now. What? So if you want to get in on this game, first ticket is free. You just have to be a follower of the camp. Exclamation point ticket in spade, uh, in chat to get your first ticket for free. Dude, I mean, I I feel like going, since you could buy two cards, going 4-2 is better than just going 5 with 6 mana right now. But I have my Peacekeeper Druid out. What, what, are my, what are my amounts right here? I have none in the pot. I have no... What? Yeah, I, mean, I have, have no spoilage in, in the pot right now? One, two. So that means seven of my eight are spoily. Wait, one. No. One, two, three. So five of those are spoily. <laughs> That's bad odds. All right. So I think the best bet here. Uh, this grassland just seems so not cool. I think I go. I'm going to build up my canopy exploiter. 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 An anomaly exploiter. <laughs> Is that the way I go? I just don't see her value yet. I haven't seen her bank yet. I think Hawk is the play, dude. Okay. I'm not pushing. Hawk is the play. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Hawk is the play here, and uh, Fertile Soil might be the way to go. Is it good? Do you think it's good to stack Fertile Soil? Or should you start a new card with Fertile Soil? Um, it depends on like what's on the board. I tend to fill up my blank cards so that it just gives me more value. Yeah, so they do something. That seems yeah, like a good but, strat. But, I mean, like we saw at the uh, at our last stream, though, in certain expansions, sometimes you're incentivized to keep your cards blank, depending on what leaders you get and stuff. Yeah, yeah, but I'm not even thinking about that. Yeah. I'm just trying to think, like, what is... For the, for the Mystic Veil pros out there, What what is a good strat with that, guys? It, it, you make a good point that it's based on the board and the mechanics you're playing with. So I got a yeah. no, noob turn next turn. Whoa, you got a bank turn, dude. Seven? Dude, I got a bank Are you turn. rich right now? I think now? I'm going to get this. Caca, calm weather. Oh, no. What? No. I'm going to grab, I'm gonna think I'm gonna grab this bird, oh. dude. All the Dread Coil Cobra, though. Oh, with the Mando. He's got a curse, but he's got a Mando, and he's got the VP, he's though. Got, he's a spoily little You know what snake. I mean? He's a like, spoily. He is, uh, he is poised and ready to strike. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, he gonna strike. Oh, uh oh, 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 hey. oh, oh, um, hey. it's hard for me to not get this calm weather, though. Are you taking him? Take, I'm gonna take calm weather, then. You're gonna go calm weather. Calm weather's just all beneficial. That's just yeah. all value. It doesn't hurt you at all. 
Oh, oh, let's just re let's just replace just that cursed that. land right there. Oh my god, you're gonna you're gonna do a full deck draw. Oh my gosh, not bad. Let's see what you get here. Which I've one? learned I've learned a few things from Gareth. <laughs> wow, that's now you're at six. Okay, here goes Sea Otter with five with his bonus after his spoil. Yeah, that's what I say. Sea Otter's got some bucks right now. Okay, so we're in the planting phase, right? So when he goes to harvest, this Candy Play Explorer will add one more card to his pile, right? From the top I of his deck. I believe that is true. Yep. And it's not this... Uh, it's it'll, not his it'll on It'll add his on deck card, I believe. It'll what? It's the so card under. Each on his card, place that many cards from the top of your deck. Is it on the top? No. See, I guess he... it's the top of the card of his deck, not his on deck card. Yeah, so I guess he already did it. I guess he already... Yeah, maybe he already did. Maybe we missed it, yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out the value of this card. He's all about the soil, dude. I mean, he took it, so there must be value to it. But yeah, probably. Okay, you know? so I think it, I think this. I'm trying to figure out this active thing. One, two, three. Okay, so it does mean what's in currently in your discard pile. So three, four, five, six. That means I have two. If there's nine, there's three left in here. So, uh, dang it, three of the three five, of five are bad news bears. Yeah. Uh, that's not... Uh, but that means two out of five are good news bears. <laughs> yeah, but what would I be pushing for at three? Nothing, really. So it's not worth it. I think this is a fertile soil turn for me. Um, and it looks like fertile soil's running out, dude. That's the thing. You buy up all the fertile soil and no one else gets in on it. Yeah. It's game over. There's only seven cards left that are uh, one dot level. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So that's what this, these numbers just to the to our uh, our sides here, guys, right here. These are the numbers in the decks. You have one value cards, you have two value cards, and you have three value cards. And that's what Lyle's referring to. Once they're gone, they're gone. Yeah. Um, and you can't buy them. So that's a good strat. Like, buy up all the fertile soil so no one else gets money. Yeah. That's pretty mean. All right, so I have... Did I really just get a two mana turn? One, well, there, two. I would have spoiled if I'd gone for it. Five. There's six each of fertile soils. Okay, of each type of fertile soil. Oops. All right, I have six bucks. I don't necessarily need to push here. Uh, that has been... I can't look at your discard. Do I want to take Hakito? Are you going to go Hakito? Hakito. Hakito um, Bukito. Get Hakito or the... Oh, I can get a Hulking... Yeah, this thorn thorn thing is interesting. The creeping mold. Oh, I wish I could. Oh, I wish I could do this and this. Listen to that sound design. Some creeping mold sounds, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, look at it. it's all red and creepy. Gross. I want that. I want this. What are you getting? You gonna go four two? You gonna go canopy explorer? You yeah, gonna, I'm gonna go. You jumping in on the bandwagon, dude. I'm, yeah, I'm thinking about this canopy explorer. It's it's I'm, I'm between the canopy explorer or the hawk. I just um, need a recycle, man. I need a logos right now. I need a logos turn so hard right now. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Next I level. I think Mystic. what we're gonna do is uh, we're going to the harvest phase. He's harvesting. He's harvesting. I think we're gonna grab uh, hawk. Dang. And we're going to put the seedling on the hawk and see how this works. What? Okay. Cancel all but one. So if you throw another bad boy on there, it's only one. If I throw another bad boy on there, it'll be like a free bad boy. Cancels a bad boy. So Sea Otter's got a four by with his free buck. Spoiled again! Oh, spoil into a spoil. Yo, spoil into a spoil. Uh, Sea Otter says there are six of each position fertile soil. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Next turn, he's banking, dude. He's at seven bucks next turn. Yeah. I feel I like am, he's, he's been doing some tactical spoiling. I am so bad, dude. I am at five here, and I'm showing eight. So there's two uh -huh. good ones in there, dude. Yeah. I have a 30% uh -huh. chance of at least getting three, which would give me another Deadwood Harvester. Oh. Go for it. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Oh, we're stopping. This Deadwood Harvester is pretty sick. It fits right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Big turns. Yes. Yes. All right. Now I'm rich, dude. 25% chance of hitting a spoil. 
Yeah, you're at twenty five percent chance. Twenty five percent chance hitting a spoil. Otherwise, all I'm getting is fertile soil. See, I might figured... be worth pushing. Sea otter missed it, so I got it. Oh, you went for it, dude! Wow. Oh, oh. oh spoil. Spoiled. Oh, and you missed out on your. Uh... I missed out on my on my uh, on my elements. Could you have gotten anything for that? Yes, that was you dangerous. Got a world tree, I shouldn't dude. have done that. But... You could have world treed. Could have world treed right there, yeah. Buy him. You're at five. Five next turn. That's pretty good. Yep. Okay, here's Sea Otter coming in at seven after the spoil. Yeah, Sea Otter's got seven. He's he can make some plays right now. You think he's gonna go? What do you think he's gonna do? You think he's gonna go creeping mold, dread coil cobra, maybe another calm weather? It's hard to know what he's going for. I feel like he might go calm weather, or he might do fertile soil water weaver. Oh, water weaver. So water uh, weaver doesn't. Does he have his? No, he doesn't have his like, exploiter out. Or his canopy. I was going to say, he would get the water weaver if he had the canopy. Out. I don't know what his canopy explorer is at. Like, if it's that middle slot, it would be great. But there might, is, 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 I'm, which one of us bought the bottom slot canopy explorer? It might have been me, if there is one. Oh, this healer's so good. She's so awesome on my cursed land, dude. She's killing it. All right, dude, what is it going to be? What's it going to be, Sea Otter? He's in the tank, man. He's in the tank right now. He's looking, dude. He's just looking. I think he's looking at this Water Weaver, man. I think he's going to go Water Weaver, Peacekeeper. Drawing. Water Weaver would be... That, 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 that's totally a Sea Otter type of, type of move, dude. Otters see, love water, dude. Dude, Water Weaver... <laughs> You're right. Oh, he went Calm Weather. He just... He banged. went Calm Weather. Lay off my birds, dude. Those are my birds. Yo, Calm Weather is just a solid value card. Dude, I love Calm Weather. It's pure value. Oh, Hive Swarm just came out. Ooh, Yo, Hive Swarm, dude. Four points. Dude, there's so many, there's so many points on this thing, dude. Dude, you're killing it in points right now. Look at you. You're at six I know, dude. total. Yeah. All right, dude, I'm rich. I mean, you got, you got some bucks right now, dude. Dude, I'm fresh. I'm freshy right now, and I got a hawk on deck. Yeah. What are you gonna do with hawk on deck, dude? I'm a fresh deck. I got a fresh cycle. Yeah, fresh select, dude. If I got to seven, I could go. Uh... I don't need to go to seven, maybe. But if I could get to seven, I could at least, like, water weave. Oof. Water weave is good, but I'd want that on my helmet strat. Seven looks so good. Uh, but I think, uh, hmm. We still got some fertile soils chilling here. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Oh, we've got mm -hmm. another canopy explorer. I mean, this canopy, I could see the canopy explorer strat going off if you do it right. <laughs> If you do it right, it's really hard to get them in position, though. But dude, but oh, if, or in the right if position. If I push, yeah. and I don't spoil, I could throw it on my hawk, dude. Dude, I gotta go for it, dude. The value's just so there. If I can get this and throw it on my hawk card, then I'm next level plays right now. <laughs> do it. Next level. Oh, he gets it, yes. Oh. Oh, yes. I have to go for it now. Oh, dude, that felt good. Oh, that felt good. If this was Talisman, I would have lost. I would have been dead. Dead in the water. Get out of here, dude. Dead in the water, I would have been. Look at you with your, your Hawk Canopy Explorer. Oh, man, look at this card. Oh. Um, and then I think I might go Peacekeeper Druid, dude. Wow, dude. This is a big turn for you. Once this turn, you may spoil, you may discard your on deck card. Because I've been pushing myself to the limit, dude. I'm pushing myself. Let everybody to the limit. How many fertile soils are left? But it doesn't give me anything but but symbols, dude. I've got one paw. Paw doesn't do anything for me. But that could just let me keep going. I know, dude. What are you going to do? I mean, the choices, dude. That may for... You know what? I think it's just fertile soil value turn, dude. Let's buy up the soil. Uh, Will says, if this was Talisman, I would have DC'd and then come back to the AI winning the game. I oh. mean, that's how you play the game, right? Oh, my only card out is you a gotta blank. Take care, you you got you to take advantage of all the resources available to you. <laughs> my only blank. I only had a blank. All right. We got five. Oh, oh dude, what is this? Cleansing And guys, rain. you know what they say in terms Cleansing of investing in real estate? Rain. Land never loses value. There's only so much land in the world, Lyle. So yeah. buying up the fertile so soil is the way to win. Any card and you may put it in your discard pile, your deck will be... Yo, cleansing rain. Cleansing rain, dude. For any card and you may put it into your discard pile, your deck will then be... You put it into your discard pile. 
in your deck would be shuffled. So you can just get rid of like a, a savage bad card. Right. But the bad cards also give you a buck, so you're kind of like... Yeah. I don't know. I mean, it's cool. Gareth yeah. did buy this. <laughs> he did buy that. That's that was true. a Gareth buy. You right. know what? I might buy this, dude. All right. You're going to get cleansed? I'm going to get cleansed. Bloop. Bloop. And then I'm going to Peacekeeper Druid, dude. Oh, dude, Peacekeeper Druid. Druid. Yeah. Getting that yeah. Druid strat. Dude, seven to five. All right, let's go over to Ooh. Sea Otter. See if you uh, can... Yeah. Field of Flowers. Oh, Field of Flowers yeah, is so nice. That. that looks like a card Sea Otter's going to straight buy right now. He's going to go... Okay, he already bought a Field of Flowers in the very beginning. This is like the first card oh. he bought, dude. Dude, he's straight up Field of Flowers. Dude, he loves right flowers, dude. Dude, look at that. It's two bucks. Two dollars right there. Let's blow that card up. Get real in-depth on this strat of this card. <laughs> what I love about this game is you can blow this up. You're like, wham! Field of Flowers. Well, I was looking at this Field of Flowers right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Throw it back in there. This this is esports ready. This game, guys. This game's esports ready. Sports oh, he's ready. going. He's he's field of flowering fertile soil. I guarantee you. Done, yep. dude. He's banging. Flowers, dude. A four. He's mad money from that one card. I so wish we had an expansion on that. You could attack someone's freaking harvest phase. Like you could be like, uh, you know, bees. <laughs> like, <laughs> be bees or bees, Japanese bees, beetles. Bees, bees. <laughs> like, Japanese beetles eat all your leaves or something. <laughs> <laughs> or like, you know, like uh, grubs. <laughs> yeah, grubs. Fire cast, ant infestation. Yeah, grass grubs on your, on your harvest. Yeah. Wait, so why is my... Okay, it says three of four in my discard, but I guess that's because I have my healer in here. So technically I have one, two, three, yeah. four... You have three or four because you have a you have a growth from there. Six, you have a seven. green dot. A so green I tree. don't know how much I've added to my pool in terms of bad things, except one. So I think I have ten because I added the hawk. OCS says leave the bees out of this. That's right. That's right. That's right. The bees. The bees. Yeah. Yeah. Bee populations, man. They're so, going down. Oh, oh, I don't have my helmet strat out for my podlings, dude. You could bring out these podlings. Oh, oh yeah. For the Mando. Yeah. The Mando strat. Wayfinder is just hanging out here. Wayfinder just chilling, man. And there's 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 like no downside to Wayfinder. No, man, he's good. He's good. But this Water Weaver, same. A uh, Water Weaver is better than Wayfinder, dude. Uh, although if you're going if you're going if you need paw strat, Wayfinder's got the paw. Dude, I'm not getting. Wayfinder got the paw, but Water Weaver's got the Mando. So, uh, <laughs> like the Thulking Horn Thorn Horns are just hardcore. Uh, but I think Water Weaver might just be like a buy. Man, I just want to put something like that on my on my helmet strat though. I don't know if I push. I don't know. I'm at four of ten. I mean, your helmet strat's not on on five, six, seven. Not like on the field, dude. <laughs> three. I have a fifty percent chance of hitting. If I hit, uh, uh, I just don't know what I want, bro. I don't know. Yeah. I can't decide. You gotta, you gotta figure out what you want. But the grassland. Oh, what you want? Oh, what you want? The grassland is pretty nice to get those greens out. You know what I mean? Dude, I, I know, man. You know. I mean, maybe I it's mean, a safe dude, play. I mean, maybe it's a safe play. I think grassland. I think we've been passing it up too much. I think I'm grasslanding here, dude. Oh, that's so I think sick. grassland's probably um. It's uh, I think under. it's an okay buy. I think it's a yeah, safe. I think it's okay, dude. I think it's an okay buy. Cause, dude, getting those greens. Here we go with oh. the sea otter coming with the excuses. Oh, do I want to get rid of Just this? Just getting crappy jaws. He says. Let's get rid of it. Let's see if we can get better. Do better. <clears throat> Dang. Did I do better? No. I'm wondering if I should just toss the blank. This is a. Oh, why is this giant toad for Mando strats, dude? Gain one for each Mando on this card. Oh. Wait, which one? Oh, giant toad card, talisman card. Toad, dude. We're back in the talisman, guys. Yeah, analysis paralysis will. Jeez, it's called the crit tank. The crit tank emote, man. Guys, don't forget, you can win a copy of this game right now. We'll be drawing the winner right after we crush Sea Otter at this game. <laughs> Ooh, there you go. Oh, you pushed into it. I pushed, dude. Wow. I pushed. Oh, look because I wanted I wanted that extra symbol, dude. Now I got that symbol. Why did you get the extra symbol? Why did you want it? 
So I can grab this world tree, dude. Oh, you wanted the... A oh, world tree right here, yeah. Well, you're just gonna get yeah. a, a couple bucks, dude, at the end of the game. I mean, fine. I mean, bucks is bucks, but... Bucks is bucks, dude. That was I don't know if that was worth the, the element push. <laughs> it could have hurt you. All right. I can water weave, dude. What can I do here? Lay, lay it out, dude. Lay well, it out, you know? You're at five I bucks. This, I, could, I could hate draft the giant toad. These hulking thorn hides are just like money, you know? Yeah. He draft the giant toad. Yeah, you're right. You could just steal it away from us. Yeah. I mean, dude, what is what is Sea Otter sitting on right here? Oh, dude, maybe you should. No, wait. Dude, he could put that on his uh, on his yeah canopy. anomaly exploiter man. His anomaly his exploiter. <laughs> yeah, his canopy <laughs> exploiter, dude. Hashtag Keyforge. Yeah. Or if he goes, he only has three dollars, so he can't giant toad podlings right now. Yeah, I know, I know. I can giant toad podlings. I wish I. That's pretty good. Giant toad podlings is pretty good. Oh throw my God. it on. I don't know why but... I just said that to you. No, I was thinking about it before. Because that's, that's. I actually think I'm gonna, I might want to water weave. That's two bucks plus two symbols. Ooh. Yeah, we Water weaved. Yep. Okay, let's see if Sea Otter pushes into the awesome combo you left for him there. Yep. If he can push Ooh, and get one. Ooh, that next turn's gonna be nice. Oh, dude, if he pushes into that, how do you not push into that $3? How do you not push for this card right here? Look at this bank card. Go for it, Sea Otter, do it. Oh, yo, Owl's back in play, dude. Oh, dude, my Owl. Dude, my, that's my card, dude. I love Owl so much. Dude, you can discard oh, any card in oh. your field. Out here in the field. He pushed. No, he didn't. He didn't push. Oh, he got the card for his, uh, he got three more dollars because of this canopy explorer. Oh, oh he got three more bucks. He's sitting nice. He's, he's going to grab. Nice. He's stacking all of his mana on, on like single cards. Oh, yeah, he's smart. Dude, he's going to grab this mindful owl. You think? I don't know what he's after, dude. I think he's either going mindful owl or he's going to go podlings giant toad. I, if he, man, I'm gonna be so mad if he goes mind file, dude. Oh, here oh, it comes. Oh, he went podlings, dude. And he's gonna go giant toad on the bottom of that, he's dude. It's a nuts card. Oh! Yeah. I did. Well, it's good we got that extra mana, dude. Damn. That was good. That was good. That card is nuts. That card is nuts now. That sucks. That's that hurts. I wish, yeah, I wish we had like offensive spells to bomb that card. I just want to take it out, dude. I want to grub that card. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I mean, yeah, I want to just take that thing out. Purge it, dude. In furnace, just purge it. Okay, so I can push here, and I have my peacekeeper druid to kind of help me get good. Oh, he took my combo right. to push into though. Druid songs out. Whoa. Great, it's freaking oh. elements, man. It's freaking elements. Oh, Bill, Yo, I am with Bill? twelve months. Showing Bill. What's up, Bill? Thank you so much, my dude. What the hell? Let's fire the wheel off for Bill I am right here. Yeah. While I think through my analysis paralysis turn. And guys, the next giveaway that we're giving is going to be after this game. And that is actually provided by Bill, who, who won uh, on our first Mystic Veil stream and passed it on. Right, Lyle? Yeah, he's passed it back to the camp. He Giving said he wanted more people in the camp to play the game. Oh. 10 more burpees for this. He's up to 65. So thank you so much, Bill, for the spin and for throwing that key back. Yeah, dude. All right, analysis paralysis time. Let's go. I'm at three dollars. I'm gonna push because I've got a freshy deck after this. Fresh deck draw. <gasps> Ooh, okay. Now that I'm at four, hmm, I could still keep going. You can keep going, dude. You can push this one. Ah, push it. Oh yeah, dude. Ah, push it. Ah, dude, it's scary. Push it. Push it. <laughs> I could keep pushing it. But the thing is, if I go and I discard it and it pops up with a bad boy again, then I'm dead. Yeah, then you're dead. Yeah, that's then true. I'm dead in the water. Yeah. But I want one more. I want this mindful owl, dude. Oh, this bear totem? Lay off my owl, dude. Oh, this bear totem is so good. What are you sitting at? Oh, you're sitting at eight bucks? Oh, dude, I almost have to push and, and take you off this thing, dude. No, dude, you don't have to push. You don't have to do anything. Toss it. Did it do it? 
Wait, what? You didn't spoil, dude. Oh, because I have the green one on. My grassland just saved yeah, me, dude. Say. Oh! Grassland, so nice. Dude, I don't think I'm going to go Mindful Owl. I think I like this bear totem. Because of the greens? Yeah. That's nice. Yeah, the green is nice, dude. I think I'm going bear totem, dude. Dude, it just saved me just there, dude. What uh, What lesson? How? I mean, it's slow. It's a slow play. Hey, I'm, I'm going with my bear, man. Crit can't bear. You know? Crit can't bear. Crit All luck. Right. Crit luck. What would have come up next? Let's find out. Oh, I could have kept pushing. Griffin, what oh, is this? Ooh, I can played. discard. You may turn your token to the active side. Oh. Do I want to discard a card? I'm at one, two, three. Nice. Wait, what? One, two, and then my Deadwood Harvester came out. I mean, discard a card in my field. Is there anyone I want to discard? No, I'm good. No, cancel. Keep going. Dude, I am rich next turn. turn. Okay, I have seven in there. Yep. I'm showing eight and Oh, I'll recycle my deck. That's a little too crazy. Okay. Oh, look at that. Goldwing Griffin gives you an extra mana every turn. What? Oh, it's your mm -hmm. lake. Lyle Bison is your lake. Yep. I bought that lakeside property, dude. So that gives you a buck every time. Oh, Goldwing Griffin is kind of... Right, Lyle's building up his thing here. Yeah. Goldwing Griffin is <laughs> exactly, kind of nice, I need to start... dude. Yeah, Goldwing Griffin's nuts. I need to start going hard at the VP here. I'm playing too slow. I'm playing too slow. This game is about freaking speed, Old man. Over here. And what, I, what would I do with the extra three? I guess I would just fertile soil. Yeah. Just just or I would everything. mindful owl, dude. Mindful owl is just straight up good, dude. It is pretty good. But I think I'm going to Griffin, dude. Uh, Hive Swarm's really good, too. Oof, Hive Swarm, dude. I didn't even... The bees, the bees, not the bees. The bees, it's so much money, dude. Hold on, hold on. Where's my... Uh, hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. With the Mando and everything. But you don't have anything. Right, no, I think I'm going to Griffin. Oh, uh, you. Uh, you're a jerk, dude. Yeah, I'm going to Peter Griffin, and then... Dang. Yeah, and let's just put a Fertile Soil on that card, too. Oh, yeah, let's make gosh, that card good. Dude, your guys' cards are so value right now. Guys, don't forget to get in on the giveaway. Don't forget to get in on the giveaway. Trying to win another copy, Bill. <laughs> Dang, dude. Look at your economy. It's working so well, man. Dude, the economy is so good. Ugh. We're playing with the first one, Bill. Uh, Veil of Magic. So yeah, we're playing with Veil of Magic. That just added more cards to the pool to start. So it's nothing too crazy. It's just a lot of new cards we haven't seen. Oh, he went Mindful Owl. Hard Mindful yep, Owl. Yeah, he went, he went Hard Owl, dude. Um, Damn it. Like this Shunshard Custodian who just popped out, who's just money. Yeah, you can win your own copy back. <laughs> Go for it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you got seven bucks. All right, I'm at six bucks. Oh, dude, Sea Otter, Sea Otter's economy's rolling too, dude. All right, do I have a Peacekeeper Druid out here? No. Um, I'm sitting at how many bucks in my thing here? Three here. I think I'm at ten. So three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight. That would leave two of those are pretty good. Do I want to jump to seven or do I stay at six? A hawk. Oh. When I go to harvest phase two, dude, I'm keeping. Yeah, I was going to say, you have your canopy. Yeah, I have my canopy out. And I'm going to yeah. get a hawk here, another hawk. Oh, I got a bountiful harvest, Chivo. Nice, dude. Eight bucks, dude? Eight, eight bucks, dude. Eight bucks? What are you going to do with your eight bucks? Dude, creeping mold is just cash money in my pocket. Dude, I don't even know what I should do with my eight bucks. Oh, Hive Swarm. Hive Swarm. Hive Swarm. Hive Swarm. Hive Swarm. Or do I go Hawk, which is two bucks? Creepy Mold is two bad boys, though. What is this? This is four. Why would I want the Dread Coil Cobra over the Hive Swarm? Oh, because I can put Dread Coil Cobra on my card here. 
So it's between Cobra and Hawk. Cobra's <laughs> worth four points. Hawk, I can throw in there and still buy something else. I think I just go double hawk on that card, maybe. I don't think you have the positioning for the double hawk, dude. I do. Oh, he's middle. He's middle tier. He's mid tier. You're right. Yeah. Dang. Dang. And this cobra. Yeah. What up, really... Sark? Says man is only half the economy. Stack your spirit symbols on the same card. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Spirit symbols. He's right. Spirit symbols, he says. Spirit symbols. Spirit symbols. Spirit symbols. So the only one I can put on is Dead Coil Cobra. Dead Coil Cobra is the only one. And wait, I can maybe push actually here. That could help me. Right? I'm at three here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope, it's definitely like a red one, right? Dang. Dang, dogs, dang. Wait, and I have two symbols here. Have they already canceled out everything? Yes. Oh, dude. Analysis paralysis. Um, apologies, apologies. Stack my symbol. What's he trying to tell me, Lyle? What's he trying to say to me? He's trying to tell me something. Do I go creeping? That's just six points. It's duble bad, though. It is duble bad. That is correct. Those are facts. Nobody likes a creeping mold, dude. Nobody likes creeping mold. You could, yeah, dude. That's awful stuff. I think I'm gonna go cobra. Dude, this is such a hard <laughs> choice because that's only so. Like, just so people know, this points right here, this VP, the two on the th are counting at the end. These four are instant, and then it's not worth that anymore. So all this would do would, would be stack my, my symbols here for my... So the only one I can put there are the Creeping Mold and Dread Coil Cobra. But it would give me three more cards at the end. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Yeah, the spirit symbols are important right now, man. I am in a bad place. I've got to make a choice. I think I'm going to go Dread Coil Cobra. Oh, he goes big boy. He goes big boy plays. It's it's good to have all those helmets on that canopy explorer, dude. I think I just want that card to be pure value. Yeah, that card is 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 crazy now. Last turn, I should have put my bear on my peacekeeper druid. Yeah, to stack your spirits. <laughs> so that they all come out at once, right? Cobra Kai! <laughs> exactly. Yeah, you're right. right. There's my peacekeeper druid. Dang! I'm going to grab another Azure Lake. Learning, I guess. Oh, gosh. See, now that's, this is how you're going to kill me. Oh, life bloom orchids. What? What are you looking at? Life bloom orchids. Oh, life bloom orchids. Look how pretty. Uh, but I actually think I want this hawk. And... But what is that doing for us? Life bloom orchids isn't doing anything for us besides just two points. I think at this point... I don't know. Yeah. <sighs> kind of think I want this hawk call. over here Should've to the double bear. paw. I should have done the bear on the other thing. Man, yeah, I messed up. Paw action here. Throw up that I'll giveaway again, guys. I'm going to copy this for the switch. To Possibly. Sun Steam Shard immediately. Switch Yeah. Okay. We're going to get over here. Switch by request. But yeah, we're celebrating the switch release, guys. Oh, you did double hawk, dude. Wow. I did double hawk on my seedling card. So one of those hawks curses doesn't even matter. Wow. Super Savage. Hey, Sea Otter, what are you playing on? Are you playing on Switch right now? With us on Steam? Are we cross-platforming right now? Like, so hard? <laughs> are we cross-platforming right now? Yeah, he's he said he has a Switch uh, ready. Dude. And how's it working, Sea Otter? I want to know. Give us the review. Yep, he says, yep. He says, yep. He's sitting on his couch. He just Are you sitting on your couch, or are you sitting on a chair? Are you are you, uh, are you you mobile right now? <laughs> or are you okay, couch? we we'll a custodian. Oh, dude, you just got the bro for points. Look yep. at you. You're at 20 points. I'm at 10. Yeah. All 
All right. Let's Ooh, Goldwing Griffin, do you wish to flip your token? Yes, please. Boom. We can get an extra mana next turn. Wow, how, how nice is that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Playing on the TV. Big screen. Next level plays, dude. That is awesome. Yeah, so if you want to be like Sea Otter and play and play this game on the big screen, we have a giveaway up going on right now. First ticket is free. So exclamation point ticket in chat to get your first ticket free. Just have to be a follower of the camp. Bill's in the hotel and he just fired up the Switch version for the first time in his hotel. Dude, level up, man. Level up, nice. Dude, we'll be taking taking on newcomers next game, dude. Newcomers next game. Win your game back, Bill. <laughs> win, win, win your key back, man. Win your key back. The key we're going to be giving away, guys, courtesy of Bill. Bill. Nomad Games and then Bill. Wait, I missed it. What did he do? He what got he Forking do? Thorn. Forking Thornhide finally. Forking Thornhide. Got it. Someone finally gave that that Thornhide a chance, man. Yeah. Well, he put it on this thing with Calm Weather, which is pretty good. Yeah, someone needs to play the mobile version. Yeah, I don't even own the mobile version. All right. Okay, I got a pleb turn here, dude. You guys are you going three bucks. Right you now. got three bucks and a... Oh, and dude, a... you're... And a green spirit symbol. Your symbol economy is nuts right now. I got a peacekeeper druid. Or no, I got a deadwood harvester. Already, did I already do that? No, you, you got your peacekeeper druid going on. Oh, so if I if I do this, I can toss one of my bad boys here with the other card I'm about to draw. So, oh, what's this life tap oracle? For each, oh, another helmet card. Search your deck for a card. You may discard it. Your deck will be then be shuffled. Each helmet on this card, search deck for card, discard it. Wow. Life type article is good. And then Moonwolf's coming up now. Moonwolf is straight up value, dude. That's two bucks and a Mando. Dude, I'm going to throw out one of these cursed lands. Dang. <laughs> so now I could trigger my Peacekeeper Druid, right? Yeah. Uh, Will says, uh, Bill's brave for uh, traveling. That his work just shut down non-central travel. Yeah. Yeah. I think I think I think almost everyone's work has yeah. shut down non-central travel. I'm glad I just got done days. traveling, dude. I'm just I just finished yeah. at the optimal time, dude. I'm so glad I'm not traveling now. Do I keep pushing? This is a freshy deck, dude. Freshy decks. Freshy decks. Freshy decks. I got one rid of one of them. I just got lucky here. If I go to five. Dude, Moon Wolf though. Moon yeah, dude. Moon Wolf is calling my name man yeah moon wolf right now but i think i'm falling so far behind in this uh i almost i'm gonna push oh my gosh now i'm five now i'm in a whole new world it's hard to tell when you're falling behind you, you think you are but like there's look at still me go, like dude. Look at me go. Left in here. i just pushed a million times dude just dude what is going on okay i've pushed it i pushed it dude i pushed it to the limit i'm at six i just need a mindful owl i'm just gonna go mindful owl because it's just too crazy right now this world is too yeah, crazy. Yeah, taking all my mindful owls, man. I'm not long for this world if I keep doing this. Unless I can do a cool helmet combo. Which I can't. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna mindful owl, dude. I'm just gonna keep it cool. Keeping it cool with a mindful owl. Taking it easy, dude. I, I love that sort of discard a card from your... Uh... Oh, Deck. I didn't get value off this. Keep them going, dude. Look at this. Oh, now Damn, my dude. economy's working. A little bit too late, though. All right, I have five. My in wife there. is a doctor, so, so I'm screwed either way. Eight. Oh man. Well, I hope she stays safe, man. I know. I know people at the front line. Even Dan Patrice, um, who's a uh, pharmacist, he, he's saying, you know, like. You got to keep you guys, you got to keep your people like your wife healthy because <laughs> yeah, they go down. We in serious trouble, man. Is so it an accident? I don't have the moon moon meme. I don't know the moon moon meme. Is that the one with all the wolves? Like what's the moon moon me meme? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Ooh, I could buy some dude. You're so I could buy some oh some level God. two veils, dude. <sighs> dude. Harvest. You can, I can, oh, I can just get a point, dude. Every turn, just get a VP. Dude, you're at 20. I'm at 11. We, sea Otter, come on, dude. Step King it up, two, dude. And you may buy a third. Wait, you got two I'll stream of Vigor. I can buy a third advancement. 
Harvest gain two new by a third advancement. That's wow, pretty good. that is pretty awesome, dude. That is pretty awesome. Once per turn, you choose a card in your field on deck. The card gains one. Your engine element. isn't built for your engine built. Oh yeah, it's too late for go for VP. So what? What's your? What's your? What's your recommendation then, Sark? Oh, Will, you got Thanks. nailed by the mod, dude. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna grab that, and I could still grab. Oh, this. 21 Arbor. messages if you were to spoil me discard this card to gain one growth oh it deleted all your messages i was right. trying to figure if out if you were to happen. spoil you may discard this card and cancel all trees on one card that is not from Here, I, um allow it's wow. a link to know your meme okay let's grab a uh, blooming Arbor. Uh, let me see if i figure out this command will uh, you either have yes. to sub or there so you have 60 seconds to post a link man as long as it's not dirty and mean, <laughs> but I trust it. Yeah, yeah. I'll allow you for 60 seconds to post that link. There you go. <laughs> All right. well, the music has stopped, so it's gotten very, very intense. Mean, he says. Fictional wolf character that's portrayed as a... This moon wolf, dude. Oh, okay. Oh, but what I is your... I moon wolf. That's all I'm doing. Oh, it's a name generator. Oh, oh, yeah, okay. I've seen this wolf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The crazy one that's like... <laughs> Yeah, I don't think it's in reference to this. <laughs> okay, let's just grab Moon Wolf. You got the Moon Moon Wolf. Yeah, I got the Moon Wolf. <laughs> Ooh, discard dude, card. Nine dollars, dude. My gosh. I'm waiting for Sark to kind of like carry me here to tell me like what, what I should be doing. Because I know if you don't play fast enough in this and you fall behind. I oh have my God, my next turn's nuts. <laughs> Fourteen mana dollars I hope you push into your double hawk death card <laughs> <laughs> oh he's gonna oh sea otter got his bank um his banked card dude with the helmets and the mando the mando he got his mando yep. strat card the that's gonna go off this mando card's gonna did, Lyle, did you ever catch up on the mandalorian uh, no, I only recently got Disney Plus, and I have to start watching it. Dude, you gotta watch all of it. Like, now. Like, tonight. <laughs> I know, dude, I know. Dude, Mandalorian, dude, Mandalorian's so good. I feel bad that I, you know, it's like, I'm ahead of you on the Mandalorian. That's so weird. That's not right. It's cool. You can, you can, you can always have one, man. <laughs> oh, he went, he went with the, uh, Life Boom Orchids. Okay, he's going Orchids. Okay, Sea Otter's racking up some points because I think he's falling behind. Of course, he's going to make a move here. He's making a move he's here. He's making cause... moves on, on those uh, those swirlies, dude. Yeah, what's up with the swirlies? What do the swirlies get? There's nothing for swirly cost up here. Swirlies are wilds, I think, right? No, no. The rainbows are wild. Oh, the rainbows are wilds. He just got roost. He bought roost. Once per turn, you may spend two bucks to gain a VP. So he's going to try to buy a win, dude. It's my yeah, turn. Yeah. All right, I got a turn here, Lyle. Swirls are wild, he said. Oh, swirls are wild. Okay, I didn't okay. see if it was a rainbow. So, um, I already procced that. I don't have a Peacekeeper Druid here with my bear, which I've learned I should have. Um, I could go in... Oh, man, I want to go into my... my I'm going to get my massive Mando card next turn. All right, man. I've got one bear paw. I need. I need to do something here. I need to do something here, dude. I gotta stack my symbols, as the kids say. Dude, this golden griffin wing. So if you have two of these golden griffin wings, that really doesn't do anything for you, right? Um, no, not really. I can get Groot. No, I can't. I'm one off from getting Groot. Oh, Groot's so good. Oh, Groot gets you, saves you, gives you points. Yo, what up, Xbox? He says he's been in an emergency operations center meeting all night. Dude, oh, no, dude. It? For the, um... The outbreak? I mean, for, your, for all your Emmys? <laughs> <laughs> Emmy award winning uh, meeting break? <laughs> um, yeah, they call him in. So, what do I want to put on this Deadwood Harvester, though? Like, I guess I want a Griffin Wing, dr dr Golden Wing Griffin thing. Um, and then three bucks doesn't get me anything. So, I feel like I should be rocking the four. So these are wild, these these purple swirlies? I guess so. I thought they were not, but... Me either. I guess they are. Apparently. I don't see any purple swirls, like, regular up there. It's only the wild. What do I do here, man? 
Hive Swarm I can't even put with my bear. <sighs> Yo, Grove Guardian is the shiznit, dude. I think I go Golden Wing Griffin on my bear. Dude, I am into Grove Guardian, dude. Um, or I just go Druid Song, Wayfinder, man. Maybe it's Druid Song, Wayfinder, slow plays for days. You know what I mean? I mean, get some symbols, you know. Get some symbols going. Since I'm so far behind on my in-game winning, I, I think you know. <laughs> but the Griffin Wing, but it's so lame. It's so cheap. It's so lame. I'm doing this. I'm done here. Getting the song, dude. I should have done this way earlier. Yeah. I. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've already almost spoiled on my first card draw. That's great. Yeah. Ah, oh, savage. Is the strat in this card of this game card stacking or spreading out so dependent on the cards you buy? Circus saying in game VP for the win. I know it's kind of like Ascension, right? Like the in-game VP is great. Um, Bill, we were talking about that earlier too. Like when we're buying soiled, should we place it on what? It's still my turn? No, it's my turn. Oh, dude, you're fourteen dollars. Oh my gosh. Yeah. What are you even gonna buy, dude? You don't even know. I think I'm gonna buy this Grove Guardian, so I'm gonna buy it. Oh, uh, you're gonna buy Groot? I think I'm gonna buy Angry Fire Breathing Groot. I mean, going and... by what? What Sea Otter's doing, he built these huge cost cards. He bought a lot of soil, it seems like. I don't know. I was asking, do you spread it? I don't know. The way Lyle's playing, I'm seeing the value in the uh, the symbols, though. Big value in the symbols. Yeah, I've been playing I've been playing a symbol game here. I might um Oh, you have to meet to discuss stuff about spring break. Vacationers around Disney and whatnot. Good, good point. I didn't even think about that. Wait, Disney's. That. Oh, Disney announced closing. Yeah, Disney should. If everything else is closing, Disney is like definitely a closing. Closing time. I was thinking that today. Yeah, you didn't get any of the game. Yeah, I think Lyle beat us in the race of the VP thing, man. I think he's just murdering us VP wise, Sea Otter. Oh, Lyle, you little rat. Lyle's a little oh, rat. Oh, you little rat. You little rat. You little rat. Guys, don't forget to get in the giveaway. We're giving away copies of this game. The next one will be after this game, which is... We're on our way there. Seeing these 12 points deplete. Yep. Oh, Sea Otter got a bird, too. So, yep, Sea Otter's got birds. Birds for days. What's he doing here? He's got five bucks next turn. Yeah, I think we just fell behind. Yeah. I'm sitting here going to the planting phase because... I would die if I don't. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I would go to Freshy Freshies, right? Freshy Freshies. That's right, Will. If Play I three chess, baby. If I push, I might as well just take my three cards, right? Oh, good. Great. Poo. <laughs> <laughs> three bucks. Nothing costs three. I am like, this is an awful turn. That's it. I can't do anything. I can't even buy a hatchery, whatever this thing is. If not the first card in your field, leave it in play as the first card in your field for your next turn. What? Weird. Weird cards in here. That was awful. That was a bad turn, dude. Uh, Fertile Soil is coming to the Mindful Owl. I will discard this cursed land. Deadwood Harvester is coming in. Uh... Um, do I want to toss any of these? No. Here's the turn I needed like two turns ago. Dang it. I'm at 11 bucks next hatchery, turn. dude. And I can finally buy some symbols. Not the though. first card in your field. Leave it in play as the first card in your field next turn. This is more like early game build a cool card. Hatchery is bonkers. Hatchery is weird. I'm, I'm confused by hatchery. I, I don't like it. <laughs> No, you get so if, if not the first card in your field, you can then leave whatever's on this card for your first card the next one. So you put it on a nuts card to get it twice in a row. Do mm. you get crits for bits? You do. You get crits for bits. You get crits for direct donations, Xbox. Will O the Wisp, dude. Nice. Hmm? I remember this card from Old School Magic, the black card. Will O the Wisp? 
Yeah, Will of the Wisps. This was a magic card? Yeah, it was like one swamp to cast this thing. <laughs> I think it was like a zero zero power like creature, but you could like tap it to get another swamp. Oh, weird. I didn't know that. There you go. Yeah. Those guys and Bill. Just... I, that, that, that's, I mean, that, that's my memory from 1995, dude. <laughs> yeah, MTG <laughs> Master's got a right. key on. Bill just spun the wheel with his Twitch crits. That's right. Uh, what do I want to do? We'll get that wheel spin off for you in a sec here, Bill. Win some people some more crits to enter the giveaway. So enter the giveaway. If you're speaking of crits, guys, enter the giveaway. Stack mana with mana. So, so Sark is saying stack with mana with mana, symbols with symbols, mandos with... I assume he's trying to get me to say mandos. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm feeling led here. So you, so Sark, you don't, you don't recommend just kind of like stacking blanks with um, mana? Like if you have like a cursed land with a mana on it. You recommend if you're going to buy soil to put that on there, stack them up. Oh, 300 Oh, bits. thank you so much, Xbox. I think that puts us over the 20% mark. It does. Puts us over 20% so to another, another 10 burpees, 10 push ups. Chris is up to 75. I'm up to 30. Oh, dang. He's rich. He's rich in symbols. He's rich in money. He's rich, dude. He's rich. I got a lot of burpees I got to start getting on, boys. Yep. Yeah. Dude, thank you so much, Xbox, for putting us over that. But we've got all kinds of giveaways going on already, so understood. Banks are for in-game to drop to level three. Hmm. While Slayer is in the tank line, let's spin this wheel here, man. Let's spin this wheel for Bill I am and see if we can get people some more crits. Here we go. Here we Your go. crit boat. <laughs> crit boat? Xbox said, I needed more crits, man. I needed more crits. Let's spin that wheel for Tanner. Courtesy of Bill blowing up with his Twitch crits. Not the same crits. Nope. Well, there you go. Oh, this man. 80. This is up to 80 burpees. You went from 50 to 80 today, dude. Or 55 to 80. Oh, and I'm out of shape, so I can't. I'm scared to do them. <laughs> I'm scared. Uh, waiting for Sea Otter to decide what he's going to... Oh, Water Weaver. Goes in with a Water Weave. So I don't know what the first one is. Oh, got another bird, dude. Stacking the yep, birds. Bird. Birds, Final dude. round. He tapped it, dude. He broke through. He tapped it. Just got to hope. I, I'm still beating him right now. And I've got a big bank turn. So now I just got to buy points, I think. Yeah, now now we just buy points. And too. I think I can finally buy some some stuff up top. And I have a peacekeeper. Uh, yeah, you have a paw and a green. And I have a you peacekeeper. Get, uh, mana do, uh, which just doesn't give you anything. So I have five here. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Push. Um, Push. Druid Song. Let me discard any card in my field. Uh, yeah, either of these. This one. Still got my Peace Creep Druid out. I'm still rich. Mm -hmm. um, so, rich. I, so that means I can just keep going, right? Uh, I think so. Oh. <laughs> yeah, well, this one has a growth symbol, so it's all good. Yeah, yeah. I still have my Peacekeeper Druid out. If I blow this up, I'm going to be so sad. I actually think this is safe, right? Six, seven, eight. Yeah, nine, ten. That's eleven. Ooh, Xbox. That's actually a good 13. question. I don't think we have a three-year sub icon yet. That's crazy to think. Oh, I'm still not. Yeah, I'm still not broke yet. You're right. I can keep going. Because I was at two of three. So now I'm at 14 mana right now on my push here. I But I'm at a Freshie's deck, right? I've almost gone through my entire deck. So the It is next month. Yeah, April is our uh, partnership anniversary month. Oh, it is? One, yeah. two, three, four, five, six. So that means every single one of these after this one is uh, a bad boy, I think. I think this is the furthest I can go. Because I think I have 11 in here. <laughs> so I think I've drawn everything I can without hurting myself. So I'm going to stop. <laughs> I'm going to stop. I think you've done pretty well up here. Yeah, I think I've got 14 bucks, dude. I'm <clears> just <throat> double creeping mold right now for 12 points. Yeah, that's right, Lyle. That's right. I can get 12 points right now. As long as I've got spots for him, right? Am I, am I right in my thoughts there? I think I am. We're good. Yeah. Yeah, Sea Otter's, sea Otter's showing the, the Founder's Badge, which is like OG. 
Dude, this is when you get Creeping Mold, man. Creeping Mold turns for days. Wait, what? Oh, it's a bottom card. Yes, yes. Um, and then I need to buy one of these bad boys. So I've got a, I've got a leaf and two paws and a purple boy. Oh, Will most... says I'm new, I'm new to Twitch. I don't think I've even been on it for a year. We've been streaming on it for five and a half years. <laughs> yeah, we've been streaming on it for five and a half years. Yeah. Okay, I need points, man. Which one gives me the most points? In the in game. And then, yeah, I've been watching on it. Prior to that too. So I can get this. Uh. Dude, you are going off right now. Yeah, I can get this. Uh, I think I can only get two points. Oh, dang it. I could have got a Veil of Magic, and that would have been awesome, but I needed that, like, a long time ago. So I, I think I can buy two of these. Right? Well, what did you just buy? You bought an Aether Tree. I think I'm done now. Okay, dude, I think you beat me, though, by three points. Oh, no, buy more than that. Okay, here we go, guys. Here it goes. Oh, I don't even get a, a, a turn? Oh. Nope. Oh, 31 for Lyle. 31, baby. 31. That's the game. Oh, I tried to push for it. Seven points, dude. Yeah. Oh. I got to say, like, like for us, this is, like, a good amount of points. When we played Gareth, he had, like, 80-something points or, like, it was like obscene. <laughs> oh, Sea Otter coming in at the 14 points. Thank you so much, Sea Otter. Yeah, I think we oh, felt. Thank but you it. so much, Will. Really appreciate those kind words. Oh, thanks, man. Truck is much higher quality. Thank you so much, dude. That is very nice of you. But yes, guys, good games. Good game, Sea Otter. Lyle, you won because uh, you played that card right, dude. You built your economy strong, my friend. Oh, my economy, dude, because that's what I felt like I didn't do last time we played this game. Dude, your economy. <laughs> I was so broke all the time, dude. Oh, your economy is so strong. Your economy is so strong, dude, that Lyle has taken the win on the first game of the night, um, which now means uh, crits for all the people thanks to Lyle throwing them out there. Yep. But, uh, you know, Sea Otter, if you'd won, the people would have gotten more crits. You know what I mean? That's right. <laughs> So oh, throws oh, oh Will Baker gifting a sub to Will Baker. That's so awesome. That's why. That's why this is the best camp on Twitch. Thank you so much. Thanks Xbox for the sub to Will Baker. Will Baker, big thanks to Xbox Mayor to him, the Emmy Award winning Xbox Mayor. So you just got an Emmy Award winning sub. Yeah, you got an Emmy Award winning sub. <laughs> an Emmy Award winner just bought you a sub, dude. That's pretty sick. Level up, man. <laughs> um, oh. Thank you so much, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching that. Sea Otter, I hope you enjoyed playing it on the Switch because now we're going to do the giveaway courtesy um, of, uh, of of Bill I am uh, in chat uh, waiting to play in his hotel room right now. Yeah. Best camper on Twitch right there, yeah. Oh, all you right, guys so, all yeah, we, we're, we're going to end, we're gonna end uh, this giveaway, but don't worry. If you don't win on this giveaway, we're going we're gonna to start another giveaway immediately after this, guys. Um, so last chance to get on this giveaway uh, before before I close it. To get in on this giveaway, exclamation point giveaway in chat. Um, so oh, thank you so much for Bill gifting some stuff to, uh, to Groggy Grognard. <laughs> <laughs> Groggy Grognard, welcome to the best camp on Twitch, courtesy of Bill. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for that support, guys. You guys are the best. I had fun when you play all expansions. Let me know, says Sea Otter. Dude, what? Oh, geez. Are you yeah, kidding yeah. me? What are you, damn Patrice? <laughs> yeah, yeah, a little bit damn Patrice. I'm returning right, to the lobby. But, but yeah, guys, if you want to get on this giveaway, uh, exclamation point, ticket, singular space, how many tickets you want to buy. Each ticket's worth 10 crits. First ticket's free, just be a follower of the camp. Subs get two times luck. Uh, and you have a max ticket amount of 100. Uh, yeah. So if you have 1,000 crits, you can go all in. Subs, if you uh, go all in, you get two times luck, so it's like you have 200 tickets in. So yeah, yeah. there it is. Uh, so we have seven people in it right now. There's one person very close to going all in. Yeah. A couple people on uh, halfway in. Should we, should we in. spin the wheel before the giveaway so people can get in a little bit more? With Let's some more spin the wheel Let's for the wheel. Uh, Will Baker and for Groggy Grognard. Will Baker, courtesy of Xbox, and Groggy Grognard, courtesy yeah. of Bill I Am. This is for Will Baker, hanging out in Austin, not having a South By this year. Yeah, I know. South By says it's crazy times right now, but uh, hey, you know. Gonna, it's, uh, hopefully, you know, I don't know. Hopefully it works out, dude. Hopefully it's all, all for, the for Chris, courtesy of Bill Baker. And then this one, this wheel is for uh, Grog. I got an awful uh, chocolate bean waiting for me over here, so I'll be chomping on that. All in now because of the sub gift, says Xbox. Oh, oh he's it stepping is. it up. 
stepping it up, stepping it up. Oh, correct. 10 push ups for a while. Right? 40 push ups. Chris has 80 burpees. I have 40 push ups. Chris has got a bean. Thank you, Mr. Will Baker, for that chocolate or dog food bean. And it is. It's chocolate, so thank you so much, Will. Woo! Look at that. Look at that. None of us getting hit too hard. Well, I, I did get the dirty dish water earlier. But yeah, you did. I you mean, got rocked. You got rocked a little bit. I, I got to say, it was like that's only a 25% bad hit rate. So yeah. not bad for the, for the for the evening. So let's do this All right, giveaway. guys. That's it. Looks like nobody else is getting on this giveaway, so I'm going to close it in five, four. <laughs> and now we're gonna draw. Oh, Kung Fu Hippie comes in with the last minute. Oh, Kung last Fu Hippie slipped in there. And then we're gonna draw the winner. All right. And it is Eric Laz. Eric Laz. Eric Laz, who, was, who had a bunch of tickets in there too. 20% chance to win. Awesome. That's courtesy That's of Bill I.M. Eric Laz, you can say thank you to Bill I.M. He threw that back after he won um, the first time. So, guys, we still have two more copies of this to give away. Um, Eric, let us know which version you'd want. Uh, we'll, and if you want the Steam, we got it for you right away um, as soon as we hear from you. But if, uh, if you want the Switch, we can send a request over to Nomad, and they said we can try to work something out with Nintendo and get it to you for the Switch. Uh, it'll just make take a little bit longer than an immediate uh, thing we can give it. Steam is just a lot faster. Um, congratulations. Right. Wow, time to open up the next giveaway. Yep, Courtesy of Nomad it up Games. As we speak, give yeah. me two seconds. Okay. Lyle's setting it, up, setting it up, setting it up, setting up, setting up. And we're going to start up, playing another up, game. Up. And it is up. Up. Woo. There it is. So, so giveaway is back in. So if you want to enter this enter, giveaway, enter, enter, same enter. way that you did last time for tickets free, followers, do it. Get in there. Subs two times left. Yeah, sometimes I um, Courtesy of Nomad Games, guys. If uh, if you want, if you're checking out the game tonight and you're watching this here in Creek Camp, uh, throw it up on Twitter that you uh, saw it at Nomad Games. Um, let them know you had a good time and uh, you're checking it out. And uh, wish them uh, congrats for. We were talking to Gareth, and uh, they're they're super excited over there. It's just game game developers having a blast um, putting games on Nintendo. It's it's a thing, man. You grow up with Nintendo, and I thought that point he made about um, it's like, man, I never thought I'd have a game on a Nintendo. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh my gosh, look at this game. Look whose username is oh. <laughs> Are you serious? Come on now. Jeez, you, there's always one guy. There's always, there's one, always guy, one guy, right? There's one guy. There's one guy. So um, we're going to get in here now. Uh, if anybody wants to join us, um, you know, we're going to kind of aim for a new expansion here. Um, I know Lyle's going to hop in. We'll turn off the turn timer. We yep. aim for like three, and I think we haven't played Vial of the Wild. I think we played... Yeah, Vial of the Wild is the one we have not played yet. So okay. let's play that one. We'll do a standard VP pool size, and after this game, we'll do our second giveaway. I know Bill's sitting in his hotel room. If you have, uh, if you have the internet, please jump on. Um, if anyone else would like to jump on, go for it. it the, yep. the the name of the room is Crit Camp. Uh, one word. Yeah, it, it's one not, word. It's not the other one. <laughs> you just saw it there. Yeah, it's not COVID nineteen. So if you want, <laughs> if you want to jump into a safe place, you know, jump into the camp. You know. <laughs> All, yeah, you have to type it in private game. Um, so so look for private game. Um, so join private game and then put Crit Camp in as uh, as the the room name. Yeah. Um, <laughs> All you, I see is COVID nineteen, or maybe he's just talking about like the state of the world. Oh, maybe maybe it's just an existential. Yeah, maybe he's just like listen. All I see, it's like he's like it's like Daredevil, but with COVID nineteen. He's just like I yeah. just the world is on fire. It's yeah. <laughs> awful, awful. You know, in every video game out there, there's people out there changing their names to all everything having to do with this, with all the memes and, and jokes. That there he is, Bill. I am Bill. We're going in with Veil of the Wild. Enable leaders. Oh, this is the leaders. So maybe we won't. Oh do... yeah, yeah. Enable leaders, dude. Dude, what does Mana Storm do? Oh, that both. one is en enable. See, we played Mana Storm before. Okay, so. so... No, not both. We'll go Veil of the Wild yep. and Veil of Magic with leaders, dude. So this is yep, going to add leaders. leaders, guys, which is kind of like um, Ascension style. Um, later on, when you got kind of like a direction to go with your leader, it kind of yeah. gives you a win condition you want to get. Yeah. Oh, Bill is choosing Okay, so Bill leader. Bill is choosing his leader first. Yeah. So and listen, Bill, this is the first time we're playing with the leader. Oh, wait, no, we played with leaders last time. Yeah, yeah. we did. Leaders we and amulets. We played one game with leaders, but we were very, me and Chris were very confused, so... Yeah. We are likely to be confused again. Um, I know that, like, in my leader selection, Gareth was, like, the leader that I had was, like, he's like, oh, that leader's great. He's so super complex. And when he said that, I picked the other leader very specifically because I did not want a complex leader. <laughs> right. I mean, I think, well, the amulet that I got randomly stuck with really killed me. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yours was, like, the you must push amulet. <laughs> I, f I was forced to push 
over and over. Yeah, that every was turn. nuts. I was like, why? Yeah, why says would I got anybody screwed. want yeah. this thing? I totally did, dude. I was like, I, I was like, yeah. why did I burst? I kept busting every turn. I was like, I didn't even do anything. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, here's my turn. So here's my okay. two leaders. I can choose either Cyrilia, Cyrilla, Cyrilla, the protector. Uh, choose one card in your field or on deck. That card gains one Mando until end of turn. What? That sounds good. And then uh, Ashe, daughter of the storm. Harvest, gain two VP, but not subtract them from the pool. She just gives me money. I oh, like her. She gives you points, dude. Oh, and they have upgraded sides, guys. You can you can upgrade these things. How do you upgrade them again? Oh, you, you pay, pay the, the cost, six. Um, during your harvest phase. Okay, let's see what her upgraded. Daughter of the storm. Harvest, one gain one VP for each bad thing in my field, but do not subtract from the pool. Ooh. Choose one card in your field until the end of the turn. That card gains one Mando and gains the text ability of one other card in your field or in the field of the player to your left or right. <gasps> oh, oh, that field, that, that, when you read that, that sounds like one of the Ascension cards that we like love. That's just basically like, like repeat, double it. Repeat effects. Yeah. Oh, dude, I'm going the protector, man. I was about to go Ashe for, for just speed, but I'm going Ashe. Ashe life, guys. Team Ashe. All right. I got two. Oh, no, wait. No, two Cerulean. Cerulean? 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 Tyler's um, Hallway. Right. What's going on? Yeah, what up, Tyler's Hallway? Yeah, get in on um, the giveaway, so I got Tyler's. Two, I got First two ones free. to choose got to be following. between uh, Gingan, the shapeshifter. No idea if the leader's good. Uh, he gives me a mana like and a curse both. symbol. Harvest, you may discard your on-deck card. Ooh, ooh that's, that's good. Cool. Then Gildan the Warrior just gives me two mana and three VP. Um, oh, Tyler's Hallway just oh, joined Tyler's the Hallway. group. Thank you so much for the sub via Twitch Prime. Thanks for sharing your Prime with us, bud. Good to see you. We'll spin the wheel for it as soon as Lyle chooses his, his yeah, leader. Let me write it down. Tyler's Hallway. Cool. We'll be spinning that wheel for you. Try to get some more crits um, for the people. See. But enjoy the that warrior, two times luck on in the, the other side. Too. You might duplicate one other card in your field. The duplicate will be dismissed during the discard phase. Oh. So I can do I can do some copies too. Yeah, and the I'm other copying. guy, the players to your left and right may discard their on card deck. For each player that discards, gain BP. Oh, so this other guy is an attacker, dude. Oh, you got cool no. ones. Wait, so so I get a so I have this guy that lets both you and Bill discard your on deck card, but then I get VP if you do. Oh yeah 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 yeah. So that's interesting. Ooh, I like I'm liking this expansion already. Oh, all right. Should I just get this guy to Oh, oh, Sansa. <laughs> or I can do oh, No, Sansa. you know, I'm going to do the shapeshifter thing because I think that's actually interesting. Doobie doops. Okay. Yeah. Do it. Says Bill. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Dude, Lyle Tyler's hallway saying some nice no things. No problem, Thanks Tyler. For the keyforge advice. Oh. Yeah, no, no, no. I I love I love giving I love talking keyforge. You guys know this. I'm just going to say, Tyler, though, before we spin the wheel, that uh, maybe you're taking advice from the wrong guy. One of us went 4-2 and two at the last Vault Tour, and one of us went 0-6. Oh, oh! I went 1-6 and because I got the buy at the end. <laughs> I got the freak city win. <laughs> I'm just saying it's just a fact. Yeah. yeah. All right, spin the wheel for Tyler, man. Spin the wheel for Tyler before, Leo, yeah, spin the wheel for Tyler. before Lyle leads you into a, a pit of Vault Tour loss. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I haven't played Vault. Oh, no, I played, um, the last time I played Keyforge with Dan Patrice in North Carolina live. That's right. You did. You Coda did play, uh, played, uh, Keyforge Oh, on the road. dad joke. joke. Okay, dad joke. Real quick before we start this game with Bill I am, who just gave away a key. Passed it on to the people. Yep. This is your Tyler's hallway. Okay, what do you call a bear with no teeth? What do you call a bear no with no teeth? teeth? Yeah. What do you call a bear with no teeth? A, a bear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a gummy bear. Tyler's hallway calls it out, oh, man. Bear. Yeah. yeah there it is. All right. So that one was too easy. Let yeah. me give you another one. Which room in the house do zombies hate the most? Which room Which in the room? house do zombies hate the most? And these are all courtesy of my son. Okay. By the way, as usual, the living room. Tyler's hallway nails it again. Oh, the living room. Yeah. Damn All right. You're two like for right two, Tyler's hallway. That's a perfect hit oh, on your part, dude. man. Perfect hit. Calls man, out. Look at that. One, like 
Bad in a thousand over here, Tyler. All right. So it's uh, who's who? So so who's turn? Le- who's Leaf Village? Bill. Okay, Bill's Leaf Village. He was Leaf listening to Village, the jokes. But Bill's also got a joke in chat. He says, uh, yeah. "How do you make holy water? How do you make holy? Oh, did the music turn off again? It did in the game. Oh, we, okay, we lost Bill, the music. How the do you make holy water? Um, um, you uh, you poke it. <laughs> you put uh, you put Swiss cheese in it. I work in an escape room. It's in my blood. <laughs> oh, okay, <laughs> that's right. Oh, that's not fair. You know all the you know all the yeah. the riddles then, huh? How do you make holy water? Um. Boil the hell out <laughs> Boil of it. Boil the hell out of it, nice. Ah. Good. I like it. I like your style, Bill. <laughs> it's also a way to avoid COVID-19. <laughs> <laughs> moving forth. Moving moving yeah. forth with the uh, the privy thing there. Yeah, all right. All so, right. Well, so it's, it's Bill's turn in the game. Bill? You have Hidden Leaf Village? I am... No. Who's Water Village? Is it me? Yeah, I think you're the Water Village. Uh, and I'm the uh, Fire Fire. Yeah, I'm village. Water. You're, he's Leaf Village. Yeah. So where do we see our our leaders again? How do we view our? Oh, they're in our deck. They're That's in right. our decks, yeah. Okay, okay he's going he's soil. He's gonna get man. soiled. So we don't. We lost the music again. Again, Nomad knows of this, and it's not because we're trying to be dramatic. The sound effects are still there. Look at this guy. This limb thresher, dude. He's made of limbs. Yeah, limb thresher, dude. <laughs> he's just straight limbs. So eventually the music will come back, but for now it's gonna be super intense, just like the last game. Uh, Wolf Rider, dude. Okay, Wolf Rider. These are all new cards. Gain they... one per card less than seven cards in your field. Oh, so if you don't... Oh. So she comes out and you have two cards out, you gain five? Would that? Am I calculating that right? I don't, I don't know. Or it would be what like two. Or if you oh, have five. Oh, we got Mr. Plow back, dude. It's been a while. Mr. Plow. And I have five to start the game off here, Lyle. Five bucks. Well, how did you get five bucks, bro? Yeah, welcome. Welcome to the game, Lyle. So welcome. you can get Mr. Plow, dude. I could get Heartwood Healer right now. I could just go Heartwood Healer. Okay, Heartwood uh, Healer is nice. Dude. Is there a way to check my hero again? Like there was something about uh, Mandos and being awesome with Mandos. Um, so I need to do something with Mandos. Is anything that gives me Mando? Um, oh, look at this chromatic wyvern. Yeah, the, the chromatic wyvern is is pretty. Is that how you say that wyvern? Uh, Wyvern? I always say I, Wyvern. <laughs> I know it's Wyvern? something I should know, but don't. Um, Bill, nine. you start with nine cursed lands. Yeah. Oh, this nine Aurora? Oh, look at the stag. Oh, these stag cards, guys. So the, you see this here? This allows you to play mo- uh, more cards inside the sleeve. That's what this double thing means. Oh. Remember double? that? That's what Gareth pulled on us before, too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He like um, was he was just stacking cards on cards on cards. Aurora is nuts. These level three cards are so rad. What? All right, I think I'm gonna go uh Wolf Rider. Seems pretty awesome, Lyle. Wolf Rider and then a limb thresher, dude. Um You can't afford both of those, dude. Yeah, dude, I have five bucks. Oh not a limb thresher, yeah, I mean a fertile three soil. Three bucks, dude. Fertile soil. Come on dude. now. I'm trying to trying to be nuts right now. I was gonna say you're trying to be more nuts than you are, dude. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go in here. Oh, uh, Friday, <laughs> you'll get caught up in them. And then I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna go with the. I'm gonna go with the strat we were recommended. Yeah, just so, so I'm just gonna I'm soil, soil myself a little bit. So, so, a little, a little soiling. A little soiling green right there. Ooh, loud. Okay, so soiling soil. green, and then. Uh, one, two, three. I need this. I need this. This card here. This is mine. What, what are you looking at? Nothing. Um, I'm, looking I'm looking at, at this looking uh, at? Druid song. Druid song. Are you looking at this Dawn Singer? No, 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 no. Grasslands. For, for Mando? For Mando? No, Grasslands. Grasslands. I mean, that's the only new card that I see in here that we didn't uh, already no, there talk wasn't about. A, there, there wasn't a Grasslands in here earlier. I This uh, game, I when the music goes out, is so... Time, dude. Yeah, this 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 is the intense game, guys. Do 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 do. I feel I don't want to pull up tabletop audio again because it doesn't show you guys. I don't want to put music into a game when we're showing it off, especially for its release on the Switch. What? Uh, that you're not getting here in the game. By the way, Lyle, did you notice? Um, we are currently starting the game with various amounts of VP at the end already. Oh, because our, yeah, because our leaders came with some. Yeah, but I think it also might have to do with your you going last. I don't know. That seems weird. That it goes three, six, seven. 
five three oh nine. No, because I think our I think our leaders have end game VP on their cards. Okay. I didn't even pay attention to that. Probably should have. I'm not sure. Though. Oh, Bill with the push. Bill with the push. Bill with the push. Bill with Bill. another push. Oh, spoil. And a spoil. That's too bad, Bill. You know. Look at that, man. He just didn't feel confident. Oh, now he's mad. Oh, he came. He got, Nepto is coming out though. He's got the gardener. Oh, he gains a Harvest, soil. Harvest gain a fertile soil, dude. Wow. Can I flip this over? Can I check and see what? It, oh, he could dude, upgrade. That's the it. most. That's the most uh, leaf village leader I've ever seen, dude. And he could straight up upgrade it next turn now because of that. That's pretty nuts, though. These nutso. plants. Okay, so how many of these do I have? Two here. Two, three, four, five. Um, fifty percent chance of doing better than two. Uh, I need a four. Other harvest. Other advancements added to this card cost two less. Oh, I remember this. Yeah. Push it. Or ten cards is good. Yeah, Will Big. I don't think this stream's ready for for my beatboxes, dude. Dude, uh, push it once more. Oh my <sighs> gosh, dude. Push oh my it. gosh. Ah, what do you do now, dude? Push it. Scary times. Dude, I'm scared, dude. Now. Now I've gone too hard. Now I've gone too hard. We've got two, one, two, three, five. So there's four of seven in there that are bad. But if I can get one more, man, I can get this Dawn Singer. Yeah. One, yeah. a one, two, a two, three. I'm scared you guys are going to hate draft on me. <laughs> because that's what you'll do, man. That's what you do. That is what we do, dude. One time. Oh, <gasps> my lady. Oh my gosh. It's your lady, dude. Dude, it's my lady. She looks so cool, oh, man. Oh, but I so can pull her out and I get wrecked harvest, if I pull her choose out. Choose one card in your field or on deck. That card gains one Mando. Oh no. I need her to be my lady. Yep. Oh no. One, two. Oh, so I'm at two. I'm still at the same number. I don't know why I'm recounting these. Five. That means uh, I'm not sure if you can see the upgrade side, Bill. I'm not sure how to do that. Yeah, but Sark uh, says that uh, Bill is is hustling us, that he spoiled on purpose. Because he wanted that bonus mana based on what was left yeah. in his pool. Probably sitting in his hotel room on his switch, all comfortable in his bed with his with his free soap. <laughs> um, Yo, oh, Tyler. Pushes it. Um, I do remember no! uh, a and how crazy expensive. It was like 350 bucks, I think you said, was the, the whole... The whole set but uh be careful while traveling man wash your hands <laughs> oh, dang dude i spoiled dude i spoiled at an opportune time <sighs> oh, uh i have a 50 percent chance of yeah be careful when you're going across that border right getting a push 50, um, are, is tyler talking about imperial spells and steam yeah, Imperial Spells and Steam. Oh, so you guys aren't only talking Keyforge. You're talking the big box train game, man, from level 99. Yeah. And isn't well, listen, me and Tyler, Tyler talk about a lot of stuff. Is it Tyler? Is it? I do my SAS ladder climbs. <laughs> wasn't, wasn't Tyler the. Uh, what's his name? Tyler. The, uh, the creator? Yeah. His name's Tyler, too, Tyler. <laughs> so it's meant for you, dude. If you like those kind of games. I actually enjoyed it, even though I couldn't. We I really struggled trying to figure it out on our when we streamed it with him early on in beta. Um. Yeah. You little. Yeah, I'm gonna grab it, dude. Oh my gosh, I should. I got caught. I got cocky, dude. I got cocky. Yeah, dude. Dude, it's that thing is value town, dude. I should have taken it. Now I'm gonna fall behind. Now I've fallen behind on on a stupid move. Ah. <sighs> Tell you pay for it. Okay, only at the beginning of the game says Sark. Man, this game is uh, really quiet when there's no music. Um, wow. So yeah, Tyler, if you got two hundred dollars off on that, then that's that's great. Nice job. Like at the price it was, it was it's just so hard to justify. Hidden Leaf Village build. <laughs> it's a great game, but it's just like is he gonna it's upgrade? A lot of money. Are you gonna upgrade Snarf here? <laughs> Nepeto, I should say, the gardener. Snark. <clears throat> Geppetto. <laughs> Geppetto with the the beard of of moss, the moss beard man, the moss beard beard. <laughs> Oh, what did he do? Oh, what did he spoiled. do? He spoiled. He oh, spoiled again. Spoils, dude. I mean, I don't know why I hit the applause. Sorry. Was that another? Uh... That's, was that on purpose? Was that on purpose? I don't, I don't think know. So. I mean, he didn't use his mana tokens. I don't know how uh, how on purpose that was. I don't think that was on purpose, dude. I think he pushed hard for something. Pushed I think hard, he's, dude. I think he's going for Mr. Plow. 
Mr. Plow. Or no, he could have afforded Mr. Plow. Maybe he was going for the work. <laughs> um, he, want, he wanted he wanted to do some big plays. Five, six, seven, eight. So that's a guaranteed uh, spoil on my part. Um, Field of Flowers it is. <laughs> Field of Flowers is the call. Yeah, it sucks in the beginning, man. You kind of don't have choices. <laughs> You're like, well... Oh, Deadwood Harvester, dude. Oh, Wolf Rider's in. Oh, it did it for me. I got my Wolf Rider bonus. Gain one per card less than seven cards in your field. So it, oh, gave, me, yeah, okay. it gave me three bucks? Three bucks on top of that for drawing only three cards, dude. Oh, I love Wolf Rider. Yeah. All right, I think we just got to do... Um, Stakes were We got to play it safe here. Oh, you're on the Frosthaven band, bandwagon there, Tyler. A lot of people are. Waiting on Everdell. Okay. I saw people excited about that as well. Yep, yep, yep. I think we're going to grab... Self-isolate, exactly. And... The best time for Automata, Atama, Automana, versions yeah. of games and digital board games like Mystic Veil vale and Talisman and watching streams. <laughs> okay. We'll do double Fertile Soil and just keep it keep it easy for this okay, turn. Okay, man. Keep it easy. Dude, here we're going to Hidden Leaf Village. I know I still haven't played Hero Realms, Will. Yeah, have not played Hero Realms. I'd like to play Hero Realms. Star Realms, Epic. I want to play Hero Realms because everyone's like, dude, Hero Realms. Um, and when we usually get into those games, we go, is Hero Realms on mobile? I haven't even looked. Is Hero Realms on mobile? Uh, I don't know that. If Star Realms and yeah, Epic I are, know. I don't see why Hero Realms isn't on mobile, right? Okay. Here we go. Bill's, Bill's going. Bill's Let's going. see. Hero Realms has got to be on mobile. It's super quiet right now. <laughs> This is the intense game of Mystic Veil, vale, guys. And eventually... All right, Bill's getting Fertile Soil. There's Star Realms. All right, he did double Fertile Soil. He's getting his economy going. White. Uh, Will says I think it's still in beta. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't see it in oh. here. All right, Chris is... Um... Music's back. My turn's back. Yep, he's got his Wolf Rider on the field. Yes, dude. I got those three extra bucks. See how it worked? Yeah. Dude. So if you push, you get less bucks. So I'll gain more if I in now. Right? Is that how that well, works? Well, I mean, your next card has got three bucks on it. So it's like... Dude, if I push and make it, I will be rich beyond belief. Because then I would get another three. I'd get... Basically, if, I count, if I'm thinking this right, won't I be at... Four, so I'd get the three bonus plus all the mana I have now. I think you'd be at eight total. Right? Yeah. Boom, dude. Yep. Love and Yeah, wolf the Wolf Rider. Rider's really good. Wolf Rider's so good. On oh, who's this? This Dawn Singer? Hello, Dawn Singer. I love you. Oh, I also love my Deadwood Harvester coming to play. Yeah, Deadwood. Ooh. I don't have any blanks though to throw this bad boy Dawn Singer on. Um, I want this to be on a blank card though. Oh, all right, come with sounds, me. Sounds sounds good, Tyler. Um, come with me now. Come with me now. Did you see? Um, I, uh, me me and your sister retweeted this, <laughs> Chris. <laughs> but Rage Against the Machine put out one of those like uh, hand washing memes. <laughs> they did. Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> to, yeah, to kill him in the name of. <laughs> It's really good. <laughs> okay, so I think I'm gonna throw Heartwood Healer. Um, oh, dude, Heartwood Healer on my my Gangsta card would be pretty awesome, but it kind of counters my Wolf Rider strat here. Um, I think I'm gonna go Heartwood Healer to get rid of some of this bad stuff and a Deadwood Harvester, dude. Healer and Harvester, dude. I think that's my I think that's my move. Kawana now. Come with me now. Is it come with me now? I think it's come with me now. <laughs> Wait. Did you say Kawana now? Yeah, for a long time I thought it was Kawana now. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm feeling I'm feeling stronger. I'm getting stronger here in the water village. So many blank cards. Man, this, this is a pleb turn right now. Dude, I'm feeling good. I'm getting better. I'm getting better. I'm getting better this time around. So I have six over there. 
seven, nice. eight. And be sure you enter the giveaway, Tyler, for a, a copy of this if you don't already have it. And anyone else out there, don't forget, we're giving away a copy of this game with music. <laughs> I promised the copies on Switch that Will I, or Will I am, that Bill is sitting in his hotel room listening to. He has it cranked up on the volume in his hotel room. Uh, enter to win. You can win a Steam key, or we can uh, chat with Nomadic about getting you a, a Switch key. So you can play at home and sit on your couch and enjoy this on a big screen. Sark says, I'm getting better at choosing my card placement. Thank you, Sark. Thank you, Sark. All right, dude. Bill, or Lyle, you got your bro out. I got my bro out, dude. What did you do? What did you do on your turn, though? Got I, did, I got a fertile soil, dude. Just yeah. soiled? All right. Soiled yeah, yourself? Just soiled. <gasps> Bill. Bill's going to have to Bill. push if he wants this field. Bill. Ooh, Bill. 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 What are you going to do with three? Just get your field of flowers and move on. Up oh, he is. Aw, oh, weak, yeah. weak. Scared plays. <laughs> just getting his flowers. Just picking up. He's going down the field. Just picking scared. some flowers. Scared. Scared. Ooh, okay. Do want Arbor Overseer. Oh. oh, he's got his bro out again, dude, and he can upgrade it once more. Dude, this is my bro right here. This is my bro. Um, and I don't think I need to push. I'm at two, three, four, five. Nope. I think I'm good here. I think I'm good here with my strat. And uh, you can join the team. Welcome to the team. All right. Okay. Get an arborist on the team. That's cool. Yeah, dude. Oh, who's this? Yo, pack leader, oh, dude. Loving me some pack leader. Yo, pack leader. Pack leader oh has a has a paw for each Mando. Dude, am I gonna hate? Am I? Am I no. Hate you right do now, not dude? touch her. You do not touch my Dawn Singer. These are my people. These are oh, my yeah. people. These are my people, Lyle. Wow! 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 You, a lot you, of good stuff here, Lyle. What you do is you push and you try to upgrade your uh, Wolverine. <laughs> you upgrade Wolverine, dude. You try to upgrade Wolverine right here. Okay, that's what you do. I mean, I can take pack leader and a fertile soil after I use Wolverine, dude. No. Do not touch my pack leader, dude. You touch my pack leader? Man, I think, I think I'm going to have to take pack leader. Yo, pack leader yo. Pack is, like, no. too good, dude. Wow, you're just going to not push and go for your bro. Although, I might I might leave you pack leader and just take Mr. Plow, because Mr. Plow is just pretty sweet, dude. Mr. Plow. You can't. can't afford Mr. Plow. No, I'm going to get one after I do. Yeah, read, read my Gingan, dude. <laughs> read my Gingan. Well, that doesn't mean you're going to make out well with that. No, that's true. That's true. It doesn't. I mean, do it. Do it, dude. Do it. Do it. It just gets do discarded. It. Do it. Okay. Do it. Do it. Push it. <sighs> push it. Because you can push it. No, I don't, Plow. I don't feel. I don't like to push, dude. Mr. Plow. I'm feeling this push right now. I don't like to push. Pack leader actually doesn't do anything for me. Like, like I don't have anything set up for pack leader. It's just hate draft, dude. You're doing it because you're mean. Yeah. might come on man push you're gonna push 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 no push. i'm not gonna crit tanks in chat i mean i'm usually crit tanking on this i'm game, not gonna dude. push i'm just going to uh wow buy up some bucks yeah that's let's not buy bad. up some bucks the buck pool's getting lower and lower it is getting yeah. lower and lower yeah it's still early games we're still buying up... Oh, uh, you have usable uh, things in your field. Buying up all the real estate. Oh, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Bill's, like, <laughs> sitting here waiting for us. Like, it must suck for you guys. I feel so bad for everyone who joins us. Okay. Oh. Let's to beat him. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. oh, you got your cheapy card there. Okay, what are you going to do, Bill? Upgrade Groot. Upgrade Groot. What up, Chris? Yo, what up, Asmati? Yo, Chris, Chris was talking mad game on, about taking us on in Mystic Vale. I'm pretty sure. Upgrade Groot. Upgrade yeah, Groot. because he probably will destroy <laughs> <his Mystic Vale. laughs> He did it. He upgraded him. He did it. Woof. So now he can harvest and we either gain a fertile sword or obtain a third advancement for two, minus two bucks, dude. That guy's awesome. There it is. Got my levels up. <laughs> I actually clicked the wrong button. What can he do? So basically, he can either grab a fertile... During his harvest phase, he can grab a fertile soil, or he can buy a third advancement 
for minus two bucks. How do you see discount. his stuff? How did you how did you see you just saw what he did? I saw it before it went away. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm trying to dig through his discard piles. Time out, time out, time out. I really like his leader, dude. His leader's good. Yeah, his leader's pretty nuts. It's the uh cut cost leader. It's a loss leader. <laughs> <laughs> He's a cut cost leader, yeah, dude. So it's trimming the fat. Trimming the fat. Trimming the fat. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah. So I actually have a pretty good chance of pushing on this. Um, but I think I'm just going to go Don Singer. Don Singer. Uh, quick reminder that we have an ongoing giveaway right now, guys. Exclamation point giveaway in chat for more details. But you can win this game courtesy of Bill I Am in chat, who we're playing right now. And Nomad. We won this game and threw it back to the community because he wants more people to play this game with us. Okay, where's my girl? Where's my girl at? There she is. There she at. There she is. Got a big turn off too. That's pretty sick. Somebody, somebody's gonna economy this game. Someone's gonna economy. Someone's, uh, someone's making bucks. Oh, we got a unicorn out, dude. Look at this. You cannot spoil while this is on deck, dude. If you can figure out combos with this thing, if you can figure out a way to put this back in your deck. Well, no, you can keep it on your deck. While on deck. As long as yeah. it's on deck, you can't spoil. So you have to somehow get it to stick on deck. You stick on deck and somehow when you push, not lose it. <laughs> yeah. Is it on deck? This is like when you're drawing your whole deck card right here. Yeah. Oh, it's my turn. Sorry. Uh, I have two bucks, but I have this Earth Chant core. So I can put a four cost thing on this. I can put Druid Song on this. I can put Grassland on this guy. Yeah, this cheapy, cheapy. Put a unicorn on it. Um, I could put a unicorn on him. Put a unicorn on it. <laughs> I could put a unicorn on him. It's like Portlandia. Put uh, a unicorn on it. <laughs> yeah, put a unicorn on it. Uh, let's see. Where am I on the push? I have three there. Four, five, six. So, Bill, I have uh, to say, uh, 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 staying in uh, hotels for the last four weeks. Push? Um, oh, my gosh. Okay. You know what really kills the vibe in a hotel, Lyle, when you're on the road what? for so long? when they don't give you free lotion and it's dry. <laughs> yeah, dude. That sucked. <laughs> so I have four. I can put a six cost I thing on this. Dying. I think Mr. Plow's coming on this thing. I was dying in the hotel's bill. I was so itchy and dry and it sucked. I didn't know what to do. And they're like, we don't do, we don't do lotion, free lotion. I was like, who doesn't do free lotion? Wow, dude. When half the time the free lotion. Oh, I can't put Mr. Plow because it's in the wrong position. It's just a smelly white Damn, dude, substance. Damn. Like it has no lotion properties whatsoever. You grew up in Colorado, so I'm always dry. Is that what you're just saying there? Yeah, I'm used to dry. Damn, what am I going to do, man? Yeah, I mean, I grew up in or or Oregon, so I was kind of used to the dryness, too. But not anymore, dude. I'm used to this humidity now. My my skin's all moist. <laughs> it's, like, super okay. dry. All right, what are you going to do with four bucks, dude? Buy a unicorn. Let me get a grassland. <laughs> Cheap yeah, grasslands. I'm gonna get some grassland, dude. We had some grassland and <sighs> what's next for you, sir? I gotta check my turn here. What am I doing here? I got okay. mad. So I'm just gonna do a soil, dude. I got mad. That was a rough man. I wanted one more mana. Would have been nice. Ooh, next turn, five bucks for you. And your Groot came out. Dude, I'm oh, feeling yeah, pretty yeah. good Groot in my next out. round Groot here. Bill's pushing. Gets himself to three. I don't know if he's happy at the three mark. Oh, giant toad, Lyle. <gasps> oh, want GT, dude. Want, want GT back. Want, want, want. What's in my pool here? Want, 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 <laughs> want. Oh, I want to upgrade my Cerulea, though. I forgot what she does. I forgot what her upgrade does. Dang it. I know it's better than this, though. <laughs> oh, dude, he's pushing, dude. Dude, don't do it. Bill. Dude, he is pushing, dude. Bill. No! Oh, Bill, no! <laughs> he took that toad, dude. Oh, I could have destroyed you guys with Giant Toad. Oh! Bill, that was straight hate draft. Oh, Bill's got, got a nice five five bucks for next turn. That's nice. Okay, Bill, made my, made my decision for dude, me now. Chris, your economy is banana town right dude, now. Might dude, might have been a, Dude, if I'd gotten Toad right now, you guys would have been done. That was a straight hate draft move, dude. 
That toad was in the perfect position for me. Yo. 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 So I could actually play this out since I have a Deadwood Harvester, and I could toss some pleb stuff. So Wolf Rider's doing nothing for me now. I could push here pretty nicely. Right? Uh, I don't know, dude. It's risky, though. I think it is risky. So w w uh, That's right, Bill. Toad strats. Learned that from Talisman. <laughs> Can I upgrade her now? No, I have to go to the harvest phase, right? I'm just going to go to the harvest phase with my seven books. I'm not, uh, my seven books? Seven books. Okay, I'm going to... Upgrade. Upgrade, Jim. Upgrade level up. So choose one card in your field until end of the turn. That card gains one helmet and gains the text ability of one other card in your field or the field of the player to your left or right. That's right. I can copy. Okay, so this, my Arbor Overseer now becomes nuts. So I'm at $4, right? So how do I activate this? I can't do this now on the upgrade. I have to wait till next turn. You have to wait till next turn, yeah. Oh, it's on harvest. Okay. Yes, but it's on the harvest phase. You'll be able to click on that, and then you can click activate. Well, I know what I'm doing. I'm take or I can't take this pack leader there. Dang. I need that pack leader. Mmm. 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 I wanted this pack leader on this other helmet here, dude. But she's mid tier. She's mid tier pack leader. Okay. Still take her though. Stay with it, right? Stay with it. Stay with the strat. Stay with it now. Stay with it now. Stay with it now. What? Right, is this, is this undo purchase? Okay. Okay, that's it. I think that's my life. Dude, you guys are so correct, dude. I'm building up. All right, here we go. I got five mana. Okay. Um, I have a... Oh, peace keep three... true. Peace keep true. Yeah, her upgrade, chance yeah. of hitting. Dude, I can't wait to copy text Curse. of any card. I'm going to go nuts. I'm going to go off. I can't. Lyle's going to buff up his dudes. I'm going to... Oh, like, okay. I can copy your... Oh, Peacekeeper Druids back oh, out. I can't wait till Bill's dude comes out. I'm going to copy that text. Turn, if you were to spoil, oh. you may discard your on oh, Peacekeeper Druid is good. So her ability copies turn. the text of one shelf of the card, not the whole card. Oh. That's crit. Oh, uh, okay. Not the whole card. Not the whole card. Um, do I want Mr. Just Plow? Shelf. Just do one I want tier. Mr. Plow or do I want Unicorn Peacekeeper? The Peacekeeper Drew is freaking good. I don't know why you're so in love with Mr. Plow. Because it gives me a symbol and a VP. Yeah, it gets you one in. Oh, I guess an in game VP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. I just I can't wait till combos go out. The greatest thing about this Mystic Veil vale game, guys, is when you start feeling those combos and you just bomb combo, it feels so good. It feels so good. Okay, we're gonna do I think we're gonna do this. He's laying off, okay. I think we're gonna get plow. He's got a Mr. Plow. Yeah, oh. we're gonna just go straight up. That's a Oh, that's you're a stacking plow. the symbols, dude. You're taking the Sark. You're talking the Sark Strat. Oh, Reld, what's going on, man? Good to see Yo, you. Yo, what up, Reld? What's going on, Reld? Reld? Reld's in chat. Reld, get in on the giveaway, dude. Get yourself a copy of Mystic Veil vale Digital for either uh, Steam or possibly Switch, man. Get in on it. Get in on the giveaway, dude, if you get haven't. In. Everybody, that goes for everybody in chat right now. Please get in on the giveaway. These are the crits you earn, and if you don't use them, they'll just go to waste, or you can use them on the next giveaway if you just don't feel confident in this copy. <laughs> yeah. Rel's gonna go. buy Rel one ticket. He's gonna win on, with a, that. on a ticket. He's gonna win. He's gonna win with that one ticket, dude. <laughs> it's it's been done before. I know. By by that man. That's why he's doing it. Yeah. You know he already owns a copy of it. <laughs> dude, how did you already get back to number one on the leaderboard? My gosh. Well, he because he was number one on the leaderboard in November, so he was. Oh, still <laughs> so he got to roll on, right? Uh, he he survived the purge partially, basically, yeah, he survived right? The purge. Yeah, those who were those who were very uh, supportive of the camp in November and so on, you survived the purge. No, it was anybody that was a, uh, from the very beginning of our inception till last November. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. Okay. Bam. Okay. Some. He took a unicorn, dude. He took the unicorn. So what the double card thing means you can stick another three cards back there, or just one. Yeah, you more? can think it's like it. 
Like, that doesn't take up a slot. Damn it, he's got a gangsta turn next turn. Oh, he's got his dude out. He's got his dude out. Oh, and it gives him a green boy, too, huh? Green boys. Green boys. So we've got we got one, two, three in here. We got a one, two. We got a one, two, three. We got a one, two, three, four, five, six. And I think uh, that means three. So I got a 50% chance of spoiling myself down to nothingness. That would seem awful. Do I push? Um. Hmm. Do I push to four? Because right now three just seems like a fertile soil pleb turn. And four gives me a moon wolf with a helmet to go with my dawn singer. So we push. Oh. Oh, yeah. you little. Butt, oh dude. yeah. You little butt. Lay off the moon wolf, dude. Nah, dude. Moon wolf, my boy. Oh, it doesn't fit. It doesn't fit. Oh. <laughs> These mid-tier. Nice. Nice. What's this Beast Brother Hunter? Gain one per card, less than seven cards. Oh, this is another one of those dudes. Oh, this gives you VP, though. Yeah, dude. That guy makes you rich. Wellspring's nice, too, though. Can't I? I have this symbol here. Why can't I buy this? Because you're still in the plant phase, dude. Oh, I'm not done. I haven't committed. Yep, we're getting a storm collar. To my pools. Storm collar, dude. Dude, I think I grabbed this woof, woof. Right? I think I just collect helmets, dude. I think I just keep collecting helmets. Push safely, bottom left. What do you mean, push safety, bottom left? Uh, it's not safe if the if the next on deck card is cursed. Unless unless he did the math for you, and assumes that it's no. It was safe. a fifty fifty chance. I'm pretty sure I did that right. I think right. Am I just calculating wrong? I think I'm taking this moon wolf. Gotta take the wolf, huh? Taking the moon wolf for the two bucks. Well, I was gonna, I was definitely gonna push and try to get the wolf, but I don't know. <laughs> See, I'm forgetting. I might push I... anyway, and if I spoil, oh, it's all right. Okay, boom. I boom, you're nuts, dude. You're nuts. So I'm nuts. Um, so if I'm nuts, what do I want? I don't know if, if I should be gaining the the. Am I am I oh am I making my my is my leader strat not really doing? Double druid song. Hmm. Do I want to push again, or do I want to get a druid song or something? Oh, there's double druid songs. Yeah, druids. Let's, uh... Those are too wild. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, we're going to grab one of these. <laughs> He's a... I feel like I'm so, adding cards, but I'm building some sort of engine. I don't know. It says build. Yeah. Whoa, yeah. look at loud. Yeah. Go Whoa. off, dude. You're rich, man. You're rich, girl. I'm a rich girl. All right, Bill. You can get cheap cards, dude. You may either gain fertile soil or obtain a third advancement for two less. And you're kind of rich, dude. So you can just go off right here, Bill. I mean, I would say he's he's uh, he's not rich. He could go two, two, and then get a four song. Oh, yeah. He can get, he go two, two, and then get a four. Uh, he yeah. could go fertile soil, fertile soil, four song all in this, in this blank boy right here. Yeah. Or scattered amongst. Or he could get a druid song. He could just go off. Or a druid, or bro, 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 champion. Which gets a double double fill. Yo, champ, dude. Dude, I feel like just I'm like gives behind. you a mando and a mana, and then doesn't take up any slots. He took the champ, dude. Yeah, of course he took the champ. <laughs> yeah, I mean the Yo. champ. The champ is just like just free stuff, man. Oh, uh, here he goes. Yeah, and he can buy three. He can buy two more, right? No, he can't. He's out of money, right? No, he can trigger his uh nepeto. Oh yeah, then he can get a fertile soil. He get a free fertile soil. That's what I'm saying, dude. That guy is nuts. 
This guy is nuts. I need to get to my guy. I need to get to my... Oh, he threw it in there. He's just going to make a bomb card. Yeah. And he can still put somebody in the middle slot there. Damn, dude. Now Bill's going to start rolling, dude. Bill's going to start rolling. Oh, now I feel like I'm so weak. All right. So I got six in here. Six, seven, eight, nine. This is a push. Dude, I want I want Grove Tender so bad, dude. All right, I'm at five. All right, I think I can I I can I can kind of risky push, right now. What would I be risky pushing for though? Right? What's the yeah. point? What's the point? Yeah, I don't know. Um, I'd be going for this. Yeah, Grove Tender. Oh. Grove Tender is pretty damn sweet. Grove Tender is freaking awesome. I'll go for it. All saved. Oh, saved because you put a uh, you put Heartwood Healer on this thing. Grove Tinder's pretty nuts, and that's that goes along with my awesome <laughs> helmets. Collect all the helmet strat <laughs> I'm kind of just doing right now, <laughs> but I feel like it's not going to work out for me in the end. Um, I'm just looking for stuff to combo. Um, Bill, I think it just means that it doesn't take up a middle slot. That dude was a middle slot card. I think you can just put another card on top of the middle slot. Here we go. I'm going to go for it, dude. I'm going to push this. But this is nuts. Yeah. I'm dead. Dang, dude. Spoiled, I'm dude. dead. Wow. That was going to be a really good turn, too. It was going to be even a better turn if I comboed that off, though. That was dangerous, dude. That was the most dangerous game. Here we go, dude. Now I'm angry, man. Now I'm coming. Now I'm coming for like you, me. dude. I agree. Okay, so I got my Earth Tank Chorus over here. Oh, and these guys. So mad, I'm gonna be able to trigger. Can't do anything. I can't buy any Veil stuff. I have. So I can get two paws. Three things two in paws. here. I'm showing three, four, five, six. Two paws does nothing. Three out of five are bad. Four out of five, actually. Four out of five are bad. Um. So we are not going to push. Man, Dead. I went for it and got wrecked. Got nine, dude. We can get. Dude, you can buy grab this. the stag, dude. You can buy this Worven thing. This thing's nuts. You could get. You can't get a stag. You'd have to push for a stag. Those are ten, ten cost cards, dude. Why is he? He's glowing like I can get him, dude. Is there something giving you a discount? You might just have selected him last. That's what. If you click away from him, it'll go away. I'm not clicking on him, dude. <laughs> I don't know how you're getting a discount, but. I thought I had my thing out. My oh, your enchant chant chorus, chant chorus does, yeah. But it's not showing on my cards. Like, which one is my earth chant chorus on my middle? Is it my middle card? Oh, it's a bottom slot. You'd have to have. You'd have to get a bottom slaughter. So okay. you could get Aurora. For eight. What's really weird is I'm only showing one, two, three, four, five cards on my field. Oh, wait, hold there. There it is. There it is. That was weird. It bugged out for a sec. Um, yeah, I need a bomb slot for that. Savage. I can get the Aurora, dude. The Aurora Borealis, dude. Gain one for every two cards in my field, dude. Double Wild Mando. Stag is an Eclipse card. Yeah, that's what this double... Double symbols mean. Ugh. Wyvern, dude. Dude, this sweet. guy's rad. It's pretty darn rad. Oh, man. It, it's, uh, this is rough. I'm just waiting to see what comes up next on your board so that I can steal it. Because <laughs> I got my girl up, man. I got my girl up. Cirilla. Cirilla. Yo, Sorilla, Sorilla. She's Sorilla. She's Sorilla right now. <laughs> Sorilla. Do I want this Chromatic Wyvern, dude? Or do I want this... Uh, I don't have any Mandos. Can I do a double Mando thing? Is there anything with a Mando right now? No. There hasn't been a lot of Mandos. There's been a ton. I'm just stealing them all. Yeah, you butt. <laughs> I've been collecting all the Mandos. Like, I want this Grove Tender, man. I should have just taken the Grove Tender. I want tender. this Grove Tender really bad. I should have taken that Just to take from you, dude. Oh, dude. Oh, I want that Grove Tender. I think I'm going to get this Chromatic Wyvern, dude. 
He looks pretty. He looks pretty polar. He looks pretty polar. He likes Amy Polar. Okay. When a card has, oh, I don't see it. When it has the rainbow symbol, does that mean it can be anything, or do you have to have a wild? Ooh. What? What? What did you take? Oh, you took the wyvern guy. I dude. took the wyvern, oh, dude. Oh man, and you got him for two cheap. Yeah, you got him for cheaps. Wait, don't I have a special card in my pool here? Yeah, I got a storm caller here. You may discard this card to use. Okay. And I'm just gonna throw wild. Some. Okay. It means anything. Okay. If it's rainbow symbol, it means it can be anything. Okay, gotcha. So gaining symbols could be good. All right, passed it on. Oh, your dude's coming up, man. Can I use your on deck card? Field. It has to be in the field. Dang it. So you've got trash. I don't want your trash cards, Lyle. Bill better freaking put better stuff in the field. After this turn. Yeah. Blow your cash. Blow your cash, Bill. Bill. Because then I'm, I'm coming in here. I've got a bear paw. How am I going to get some more symbols, dude? How am I going to get some sun symbols? You guys better get some sun. You got no symbols down here? Nah. I need some symbols, dude. I need some symbols. I need a mm -hmm, sun symbol. Mm -hmm. So right now I've got a bear paw. So I could discard that for... I could get this Sunstone already Okay, he's taking the six bucks here He pushed in Six bucks, six bucks Six bucks Man, this Grove Tender could go off, dude Dude, look at this Ley Line Overflow Harvest after determining your That's what he bought Is that what he bought? No No, no He took the Grove Tender He did Oh, dude, Bill just... Grove tending, dude. Oh, look who it is. It's a Peace Brother champ. <laughs> Ooh, but I could get two more bucks here. Okay. So, if I stick around here... Five. Uh, six, seven, eight. No, that would be bad. Uh, well, it's a very low... Ch I mean, it's kind of a low chance that I... I have a pretty good chance of getting another buck, but I can get bucks other ways. So, when I go to Harvest, I choose one card in my field, until in turn gains one, and gains text in, of another card in your in your field, or the field of the other player. So, if I stack this... I could eventually get um, stream of vigor going, actually, I think. So I'm gonna go like this. Now, if I trigger this, and tell me if I'm right, Sark, if I trigger her ability and put it on my pack leader, you would get one other paw. I would get another paw, and then I could discard, I can discard this storm caller to get a leaf. And that would give me two paws and a leaf. And I could get Stream of Vigor. I think that works. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to use this. Uh, what? There's a lot of sound effects out there. Oh, it changes it. No, this is not what I want to do. It changes what I have. <laughs> There's a lot of sound effects happening. No, it's, so it swaps it out. Oh, I see. Right, yep. If I discard that. So basically, I get two paws. Ooh, what do I want to do? And you guys don't have anything good, except for getting more money. Yeah, I think so. I, I mean, get... I can give you a curse, man. You want to get the curse? So two bucks here... Or I could do any, I could double up anything in my my thing. So I could double up my like my deadwood harvester to toss one of my red boys. I think. Oh no, I can't at that point, right? So I might as well just take two more bucks here, then I get ten. Yeah, you you got ten if you. And then I can get this aurora, more. dude. Because <sighs> the one bear paw's not doing anything for me. 
I do two bear paws, I can get a sunstone airy. Harvest once per turn, you may spend two bucks to use any as another. I'm not sure, but I don't think she can copy symbols, only text. Oh. Oh, that would that changes that changes. It gains the, the text ability of one other card in your field. Oh, so it's not like Keyforge mimicry where it grabs the amber pips too. It's just like <laughs> So I guess giving getting the two paws is probably my best thing then. Out of everything that's out here. That's probably the best thing I can do. Dang, dude. What? From modify card from to pack leader? Select? Yeah, you got a second paw now. Okay, I got a second paw now, right. Yeah. So then I can discard this. To turn one of the paws into something else. To turn it yeah. into, a, into wild. a wild. Yeah. So then I can buy this. Yeah. Okay. Got it. Got there. We got there. And you still have eight bucks, so. Yeah, I still have eight bucks. Um Dude, this ley line overflow is stupid. I know, ley line overflow is pretty is pretty rad. Or it could hive swarm onto this thing here for pause and sun stuff. And now that I have this, oh, dude, Leyline Overflow is just so cool. Yeah. It just doubles your money. It just doubles your money, dude. It's just so much money. Yeah, it's so much money, dude. Money. Where do I stick it, though? Um... I think I stick it on here. I think I'm taking one of those bad boys. Okay. Interesting. I don't know. I don't know if I did that right. All right let's see what happens on your next turn. Oh, Give it to the moon. Right. Oh, I could have gotten two more bucks if I'd gotten to the moon wolf then. What? What? Or am I? I am think I, we're gonna push. Let's push. Am I behind on chat now? Okay. Why would I have given it to the moon wolf? Would I gotten two more dollars? I think we got four bucks. I think we're gonna. We probably. We probably gonna get to move. Off. What is this guy doing? Oh, I could. You could push to try to upgrade him, dude. You could push. Why? Why? No, it's fifty-fifty for me to push. Um. Fifty-fifty, yeah. dude. Fifty-fifty wins games. Fifty-fifty wins championships. Oh, Moon Wolf. Moon easy, Wolf. easy clap. Easy clap play. Okay. Took the safe play, Lyle. Yeah. Are you going to discard that card? No, I'm going to keep it. Ah. Oh, Bear Totem. Okay. Love me some Bear Totem, dude. Bear Totem. Or, dude, just go Ley Line Overflow twice. Yeah, dude, double ley line is 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 so rad. And then just like bye, 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 yeah, bye. Yeah. <laughs> dude, we got a close game between bye, you and I. Bye, bye, <laughs> bye. We got a close little game here. Okay, what's, what's Bill doing? Bill's rich. Bill's looking through. He's looking at this bear totem. Pretty sure. Yeah, Bill's rich. Bear's looking. He's at looking at ley line over. I see him. Yeah. Oh, he's he's buying in. He's investing. Bear totem. I knew it. Bear Dude, totem. He's, he's buying everything I buy. <laughs> <laughs> he's straight up just buying all my goods, dude. You're buying all my goods. Okay. Triple, triple fertile soil right there. Oh, there's hatchery, dude. Hatchery's back out. Oh, he's going to have a good turn next turn. Okay. Oh, he's got his bro out. Cheap buys, cheap buys. Cheap buys, dude. He's got the giant toad out, too. All right. Dude, I got my pack leader out again? And I got my Dawn Singer out? What? Oh. Oh, uh, and I can spend two bucks with my Sunstone. Oh, but I have to have... Spend two to use any symbol I've already generated as a wild. Oh, gosh. I'm not liking that card, dude. Okay. We're at four bucks. We got some symbols. Do I push? Risky. Risky. Mm-hmm. Four dollars got the hatchery 
Not the first card in your field. Leave it in play for the first card in your field for your next turn. That's yeah, pretty nice. That's pretty good. So I put that on like. <sighs> what do I put that on? Maybe I hatchery like my pack leader. Oh, that's OCS. You're right. You're now in on the giveaway. Oh yeah, get in on it, man. Everyone else too. Don't forget. Dude, do I do I go pack? Do I go hatchery? Hatchery is pretty cool, man. Well, wait. I'm going to gain one for each, so I'm going to get five. I'm going to have five bucks. Dude, this guy's kind of lame. I could push. I could push. And that would give me six. That doesn't do anything for me. Let's move on. Oh, it's already calculating it out, huh? Um, okay, so I can then spend two of my dollars. If I don't go hatchery, I can spend two bucks to get a wild. And then I could go sun. Or paw. What's this do? When bot, you may turn your token to the active side. Eh, what? No. Um, these are just points. If you were to spoil, you may discard this card to gain a thing. That's pretty nice. I think this Wellspring is pretty much where I want to go. I think Wellspring is the way it rolls. <sighs> or do I hatchery into my pack leader? Has anybody mentioned the Druid song? Yeah. <laughs> uh, really? Is Druid song that great, though? I mean, really? Okay, I'll take it. I'm going to take it because... Oh, you bastard. I wanted the Druid Sog. Why? Thanks a lot, Is this because it's wild? Thanks a lot, Sark. I don't I don't really see, like, the full... Is that it? Just because it's a wild? It's any symbol. Great. Awesome. Appreciate that one, man. <laughs> is, that, is it really it? Is it because it's any symbol? I mean, is that the... Severely All right, what do I want to do here? Um, I don't I mean, want to I push. guess I do. Because I guess if you can get rolling on things like this, like every harvest you get a free one. Yeah. Gain one permanent thing. This is pretty awesome. Ancient, you know, ancient life roots is pretty sick. I mean, these ones uh, are the cheap boys. Well, but... now that you took what I was going to get. Yeah, that's just money. Now I have to think about this. I mean, this is pretty sick. So you're right. If you, if you want to go... Yeah, I have been underestimating the value of those. Now Lyle's back in the tank with his big bucks. Yeah. Where's my ley line overflow happening, man? That better happen next turn. Nope. I'm thinking about grabbing that ley line. That's the big money card, dude. That's the big boy card. You got That's two it. We're taking it. Mmm. Taking the ley line. And zeroes it out, huh? Oh, you took it for cheap. That's right. Yeah, I took cheapo, it for cheap. Oh, cheap. And uh... throw a buck in there. Throw that in there. Veils that give you more spirit symbols run away with the game, says uh, Sark. Let's... These being the veils. Yeah. So basically, pool of light can be just go off. Oh, you got your bro. You got bro out, dude. Reverend, dude. So you got two wilds, man. Yeah. Okay, here's Bill's nuts turn. He can he can get he can get stuff, man. He can buy like three stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's pushing, dude. He wants stuff, dude. Dude, he wants stuff. Oh, he's got his peacekeeper druid active. That's why he ain't scared. He's got a stupid toad. <laughs> Dang it, man. Oh, dude, Bill. <laughs> his big boy bear card's coming out soon. Yep. Oh, but he activated his Peacekeeper Druid. Yeah. So he could he could die off. Oh, he's not doing it. 
No, he's no, he's no, he's playing it safe. Oh, oh hive swarm, baby. hive swarm on the toad, on the toad. <laughs> That's a, this is a big card right here. Big plays, big plays right now. He made a move. Still coming wow. in with the big plays. He made a move. Oh, now he's gonna buy a leyline nexus or a blooming arbor. No, he can buy a. No, no, he, no, he can he can get. Oh, he can't get any of them. He can't get any of them. He didn't need a paw. Yeah. Yeah, he needs a he needs a sun. That's but he's gonna activate his dude to get another fertile soil. Or not. Oh my gosh, look at this turn he's got. Oh my oh my god, this draw dude. He is rich now, dude. He's going off. Alright, I think yeah. I'm in a position two, three, four, five. I think I have to push, dude, at this point. I think I've got good stuff in here. I've got good stuff that I'm coming up on. Alright. And I hear you. I mean, four bucks is nice. I've got some scary stuff in here, but oh, come on. Ooh, look at you. Where's my good stuff, man? Where's my good stuff look at? at? You. I want my. I want my. I want my good stuff. I know, Bill. You rich right now with eleven. Ah, uh, like hatchery. I don't want on any of these. I don't want like any of this stuff right now, except Wellspring. Wellspring's pretty sick. I could throw it right on this card here. Be happy boy. You know, be a happy boy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Why am I greedy? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. oh. oh. The wolf is here. The wolf is here. <laughs> five, dude. Oh, there's five of them in there. There's four of them in there. Oh, man. <laughs> this is too risky, dude. No, 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 no. That was a good push, he said. All right, I'm staying. I'm not going to push this. I don't know how he's saying that in chat. If this is good push or... What does that give me if I get up there? This gives me a... I'm stopping. I'm scared. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. Scared, scared, scared. scared. I feel like that's okay. Okay. Oh my gosh, Lyle, look at my turn! Yep. Wow. Okay. Someone's getting the turn, dude. Someone's getting the turn. I we don't got think $20 I next turn, dude. And then I hope you guys get something awesome because I'm stealing it, dude. I'm stealing it. I'm getting rich. I don't think I can push. What's this guy do? Gain one VP for each on this card. Oh, boy. He's... Oh, yeah. and he fits... He fits, this Feral Chieftain fits right in on my card here. Oh shoot, he does on your card too. I was gonna say, I'm gonna grab this Feral Chieftain and probably no, put no. it in my Wyvern, dude. No, dude, no, dude, why would you do that, man? He didn't do anything for you, dude. You don't need yeah, him. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> oh, you suck. Ow! Oh, dude, that's my card. Yeah, stack some symbols, baby. Oh, dude. And now I can grab two wilds. Dude, make oh, the Dark Wolf Burrow is pretty good. Dude, make some awesome cards, because... Uh, you know what? I'm going to grab the Burrow, dude. Get a bonus bonus yeah, point next flip, turn? Yeah, my token. Yeah. All right, dude. What a waste. <laughs> All right. All right, Bill. Wait, what did you draw, Lyle? You didn't draw anything. You drew dude, trash. Wow, that was bad. That was a bad draw. Trash, trash card. Okay, I need Bill to draw some cool stuff because I could just go off here. Dude, if you'd drawn your Leyline Overflow, I could have copied that. <laughs> and then gotten like 40. <laughs> nice. Oh, look at this Sundered Land. Whoa. What am I going to buy? I have so much money, so much money. Oh, oh. he's buying rhinos. Okay. Buying rhinos, dude. I want to rah, 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 rah. He's buying rhinos. What else is he going to buy? Actually, he's he, got so much money, dude. He didn't get value off that Grove Tender. He put his rhino on there, and the rhino doesn't have a... a uh, yeah. A Mando, or Mando, dude. It's not a he Mando could, I mean, he could put He could have put Dread Coil Cobra on. Oh, wait, no, he couldn't. Uh, it's in the same spot. Yeah, maybe he was But he, he was wants that Cobra out. anyway. He was locked out. He's taking all the Mandos, dude. 
double the I like the sundered advancements the hand, on this card, including text effects. Well, he undid that purchase. Whoa, oh, rewind. Oh, he took the Sundered Land. Yeah. God, oh, 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 my, dude, oh my gosh. Is, dude, he is, he's popping off right now. Oh, what am I stealing though? What am I stealing? What do I do? What do I do? Dude, he's popping off right now, dude. What do I steal? What do I steal? Dude, what do I steal? I think I'm going to steal his dude with my dude. I think I steal his dude with my dude. Can you steal his dude? Yeah. I guess, yeah. Harvest, you can either gain a fertile soil or obtain a third advance or two less, maybe. If I push I'm at five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think that's all I have in here. Right? So I could push yeah. and get more money. Do I have 10 spoilages in here? Did I pick up I don't anything? Know, do you, dude? I don't know. I'm scared now. <laughs> I don't know if I have 10 spoilages. I think I'm a safe push. I think I'm a safe push. Am I getting greedy, though? It would give me, like, maybe two more bucks. But you know what I'm about to do? What, what are you going to do? I'm about, well, I'm about to steal. So I'm, I'm just going to chill. I'm going to chill. I don't want to get greed. Oh, 20 bucks. Yeah. It was like with a, with a cool 20. Yeah, with a cool 20 bucks. I can also spend two bucks to change into my symbols, which I don't have. So I was thinking of buying. You know what I was thinking of buying? Stag champion. And putting this Aurora on it. Because then he doubles the VP I gain from advancements on this card. So I would gain two for every two cards in my field with this combo. Wow. Right? Yeah, that's true. I could just go <laughs> off. That's crazy. <laughs> that's nuts. And I could put them both on this dreaded bad curse land over here. I'm getting the yeah, thumbs that's, up. That's crazy. So, but if I have a, if I had another card where I could get more VPs, if I put this, so if I put this stag champion on this moon wolf. No, the moon wolf is a silver VP. Yeah, I'm just saying Double if I put him there, it gives game. me, it's an eclipse. So I can put another, I could put oh, you like, can put it on the more wolf. Yeah. Yeah. I can put the stag champion on the more wolf, even though it's a mid tier thing. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I can do that. Yeah, you can. Because you can double up on the middle. I could double the middle. I could double the middle. I could double the middle. Could double the middle. Okay. And what other thing do I want to steal? If I activate her, what am I stealing? I'm going to steal this dude. You may either gain a fertile soil or obtain a third advancement for two less. I think is my best bet. Man, I wish this toad was out. All right, let's fire this up. What? I can't select him? Oh, I have to select from here to here. Okay, so now he has your thing. You may either gain a fertile sword or obtain a third advancement. So my moon wolf now is has two <laughs> really cool things on it. Um, I'm then going to go Stag Champion. What? 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 How do I buy it? Oh, there we go. Uh, an Aurora. Man, that's so good. And then, because of this, you may either gain a Vertal Soil or obtain a third advancement for two less. Right? Yeah. So I can activate that. I guess I get a fertile soil. So where do I want to put that? I guess. I guess I put this fertile soil here. Man, this is giving me lots of... How do I do this? Uh, discount advancement? How do I... Oh, here we go. Here we go. Nice. And then Crazy, am I done? Dude. Or do I get a third less thing now? 
Well, oh, there's no more fertile soils. Okay, so I think it's done, even though it's still glowing. Yeah. Am I done? <laughs> I just got thumbs yeah. up. All right. That was a good turn, dude. Yeah, that was good. No, I don't want to tell there. you that, but it was good. Ooh. All right, I think I'm going to bust if I push, which kind of sucks. Okay, okay, this is the comeback turn. Just the casual amazing turn. <laughs> yeah. I just had to think through that, learning how these cards like interact. Sorry about that turn taking forever, guys. Oh, it's your magic card dudes back, Willow the Wisp. Look at this stack. There's a really good chance for me to push and spoil. Do it. Damn. I think we're just gonna do this. We're gonna grab stupid. What? The forest song. Oh, slow turns. Man, slow turns, dude. Dude, slow turns. What happened? Okay, here comes Bill's nuts turn, dude. Here's Bill's chance to gain some some VIP. You're beating me by one. I know, but it's uh, I'm not long for this world, dude. I, my my deck isn't set up well. Dude, I'm, I'm chasing for the win. I got to get at least one win tonight. I got to get at least one win tonight before this next giveaway, guys. Be sure you enter to win with the late night hanger outers. Thank you so much for hanging out and dealing with our crit tank. But we hope you guys. I know we got we got to get this we got to get this game going. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna do a quick bio break. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I'm about to crush it right here as soon as I drop some. Get this thing moving along. But yeah, be sure you guys enter to win. Um, check it out. Let us know if you want it on the Switch or on Steam. We'll do our best to get you a Switch key from Nomad, but we can definitely get you the Steam key. Um, and I hope you guys are enjoying it. Right now, Bill, whose turn it is, is playing on his Switch. Uh, earlier, Sea Otter played on his Switch and enjoyed it. Uh, you guys are earning crits by watching, donating, subbing following and you just got to be a sub so thanks to nomad for that oh spoiled bill what bill what happened dude you pushed it Ooh. oh did you make it though oh you tried to use your uh, peacekeeper druid didn't work out dude didn't work out oh no and then you drew into the crap and so did lyle what is this thing a druid song? You guys don't have anything cool. I don't have my thing to steal, though. Anyway. Okay, I have five bucks. If I could get... I could get mad symbols. Um, If I can get this dude. Stag, but I need four more bucks. So I'm at five. All right. I'm at zero. So I'm at, oh shoot, this would be awful to, to push right now. This is one, two, three. Okay, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks. Druid song? Druid song's out, you know? Everybody loves a druid song. Druid. Mm -hmm. Maybe this is just my time to, to take a druid song and just move on, you know? Take a druid song, move on. Yeah, I think that's it. I'm not going to get greedy, Lyle. Druid song and pass. Druid song and pass. Sark said I should push. You crazy, man. See, if I'd pushed, I'd been dead, right? Oh, I spoiled. I, I did I did bad math. Oh, spoiled, got bad math. So did um, yeah. So did Bill. Bill spoiled, too. I like the yeah. dangerous one. Ooh, you guys. Okay, he's up. I could have cycled back to Aurora. push you can cycle back to aurora oh you're oh i see what you're saying i should could i should be pushing it because if you push it then basically you just dump all those cards and you come back to yeah i can get to her faster yeah. i see i see what you're i mean i would have spoiled there but you guys spoiled so it would have been a good chance to just make a rush for the win yeah that's a good point dang it more push equals more cycles equals logos. I get you. I get you. Yeah. Need to move. And if I can get a hatchery on that thing, what? What up, Storm Yo, Strong? What up, Storm Strong? Dude, if if I can, dude, if I can get a hatchery on that nuts card, oh, <laughs> dude, this game it just feels so good when you build like a, the nuts card. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Bill's pushing for that eight. 
He wants the money. He wants the money. Dude, that ley line. <laughs> it was so stupid. I can't believe I hit it with 10 mana on the board. Mm -mm. Bill spoils. Alright, let's go. Oh, this is a good one for Bill. Alright. Oh, Bill got some good stuff up in there? What's he got? What's he got that I can take? Oh, Mr. Toad. That's his name. Oh, he's got his dude back. Hello, Mr. Cool Dude. Yeah. So I might be stealing him again. Um, What am I at in here? Two? Three, four, five. And then four, so... It's actually probably not a bad push, right? Five. Um, if I push to six, like everyone's saying, just go for it. Let's do it. Spoiled. Sadness. Pure sadness. That's my name. I could have gotten a hawk, Lyle. I could have just taken a hawk. Mm-hmm. I know it's tough, dude. It's tough. Oh, I was trying to go for the win. Now I'm greed. Now I'm super greedy times. Super greed. Egregious. <laughs> I see you got time for Mystic Veil, but not Keith Forge as Stormstrong. Savage. <laughs> One of these days, man. Dude, I haven't played Key Forge. I haven't. I just said I haven't played Key Forge. Wow, when was the last time we played Key Forge together? Like weeks. I had nowhere to put the Hawks as Sark. Okay. Yeah. But I, I didn't get the thumbs up, so I'm sad. Oh, you're doing this dude, huh? I'm doing that dude. I want to see what happens there. So if you get if you get minimal cards, it'll just put oh, out eight yeah. cards. That's pretty sick. I knew I shouldn't have pushed. Oh. Perfect. Uh, man. Okay, here comes Bill. He's got his bro. He's got his Nepeto. Nepeto. But I mean, his fertile soil gain is like, man, right? There's no more left. So he just gets an advancement for Situ less. So they think this thing's kind of dried out. You know what I mean? Yeah. So his his cheap buys. He's got the money. And he's got symbols, dude. He could be somebody. You could be somebody. <laughs> you could be somebody, Bill. I I just need my girl to, to seal the seal the deal here with these symbols, dude. I mean for the for the VP. I need a Grove Tender. And I need my girl to drop. And I think I'm sunk in this game, dude. I'm just... Dude, you're right not... behind me, man. We're, we're no, so close. No, but it's just... it's um, The deck is not... doesn't feel good, dude. I have a bomb turn that I just have to dig for. I have to bomb... You haven't even got your Ley Line thing, have you? No. Where is it? I have so many freaking cursed lands I can't push and cycle. It's like... You're not countering them, I guess. It's rough because there's no there's no growth to be bought. <laughs> right. This Sundered Land he got kind of saved him here. Yeah, I wanted that real bad. He he took it. Yeah. Bill Bill fell asleep in his hotel bed. It seems. Yeah. <laughs> he think he's adjusting all the pillows he's got there. He's like, I know, I know. So many. What's and what's the deal? What's the deal? <laughs> what's the deal <laughs> with hotel rooms? Now, putting the little, like, smaller pillows on the hotel beds. They're, like, they're not the longer, like, queen-size si pillows. They're, like, the little squarey ones, you know? What's know, with man. the, what's with the pillows? What's with the pillows? Are you telling me? <laughs> what's our with heads the have gotten smaller over the years. <laughs> <laughs> like, seriously, you know? Like, I want my pillows all equal size. You know, I don't think it, you know, if it's a decorative pillow, fine. You throw it off. Yeah. The odd one is when you have like three of the square pillows. Yeah. And you're, like, you're kind of like, are three square pillows taking up the same room as two regular pillows? Like, yeah, not even. It's like one and a half. One and a half regular pillows. Oh, he yeah. bought a thing. He bought a Leyline Nexus. Oh, Leyline Nexus. Oh, it's, is my turn. And I spoiled Ooh, last time. So five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, I know, like, one of those is not so bad. I have 12 bucks anyway. Yeah, 12 bucks anyway. 12 bucks anyway. Oh, I got my ley line overflow to proc. That's pretty sick. What? 
What? What? Oh, but I don't have any value for this wind whisper, do I? No. Yeah, I was gonna say it was like um, none of us have got spirit symbols really, so that's not good. Twelve. If I could go, I kind of want to go grove tender with a hatchery, dude. Oh no, my ley line. <gasps> I could throw the sap. Oh. oh no, it's not the first card in your field. That's the first card in my field is my ley line right now, right? Dang, dude. If this yeah. was like the second card, that would have been nuts. If I could throw the hatchery on there. Um, do we even want a stag? What do I buy with this? Like, if I throw the hatchery on this guy, it just keeps popping back up, and I keep making bucks. So I think this is a buy. Um, I think this is a buy. And then go... I think I throw this grove tender on this bad boy over here and start going crazy. I just wish I had some helmets, dude. Yeah, the hatchery on the ley line overflow is really interesting. Except I'm not going to get value of it. Well, not this turn, but Will o the yeah, you could later. Will o the wisp, Lyle. Will o the wisp. Uh, I think I like Grove Tinder, personally. I think I Grove Tinder. And then we'll see. We'll see what happens, huh? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Jeez, these bomb turns, dude. Uh, don't I'm gonna push. I'm gonna push because I have nothing good to put anywhere, I don't think. I mean, I guess I could put this Beast Hunter. Beast Brother Hunter. Beast Brother Hunter, yeah. That would have actually been good for you there. You would yeah. gain a bunch of pointage. Yeah. Man, we're so close. Shoshink. Shoshink. That's good. What's he coming out with? Oh. You're kind of getting these low turns, huh? Yeah, what no, I'm, I'm telling you, these are like all my turns. That's why yeah, it sucks. You can win a copy too, Despam and I. We're giving away. We're giving away a copy because of Nomad Games. Come bringing it to the Switch tonight. What? <laughs> Bill's turn. So be sure you yep. enter, man. Yep. Enter, Despam and I. Enter. Everybody's got a chance when to win. Enters. Yeah, man, we've been digging it. Yeah, Stormstrong, everybody else, if you haven't gotten in, we're going to give away a copy right after this game, and then we're going to open up a long-term giveaway. So if you guys don't win the next copy, we're going to open it up until the next stream. Exclamation point crits, not bits. Oh, I didn't even know we had the bits command. But I didn't know we that. had bits command. <laughs> I was like, to buy? What? Is that even <laughs> still relevant? Do you use the type chit cheer? Oh, it is. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'm glad our... I'm glad our I'm glad our things still work. Yeah, each uh, each ticket costs ten crits. Yeah, ten hundred hundred ticket max. Okay, what do we got here? Okay, we got some stuff. I got some stuff. I got some ten ten crits here. Um, oh, this was my card. What? This was my Aurora card. I gained one for every two cards in my field. Did I not? Oh, and harvest. So what am I at? Two, four, six. And then it doubles. Yeah, you're, that. you're running away with this game. So that's this 12. Sense. Now that that card dropped. Um, do I have space for this in my hatchery? Like, how do you see the other side? No, I don't. I don't have space for the hatchery there. That would be sick. Yeah, getting a hatchery on that would have been nuts. Yeah, I had the slot for it too. Um, 10 by, 10 by. How do I, how do I see where I have space on this if it's an eclipse card? How do I know? Like, I have a top slot, obviously. Yeah, but your middle slot has the dude underneath it. Yeah, and the bottom's the Aurora. So can't I put can I put another thing over the bottom? No, you can only put, I don't think you can only put it over the one that he's that they're tabbed on. Like, say, Wind Whisper over here has yeah. a bottom slot. I think you can only overlay on the bottom slot. OK, OK, so I could still add I to the I think top. that's how that works. OK, I could still add to the top slot. 
could still add to the top slot. And I have two sun symbols and a wild. Sun shard savannah, two sun symbols. Okay, I'm just going to take this. Okay. And... Oh, this pool of light is freaking awesome. Pool of light is nice. I mean, I just sort of want to get this, get these cards going, man. Um, what's a big boy? What's a big boy top deck? There's no top deckers that I really want right here, except this Sun Shard Custodian who just gives me some money. Stuff at the end. Harvest game one for less cards in your field. Blah, blah, blah. Can't get that on there. Can I put Wind Whisper on that? On what? Like, if I put Wind Whisper here... Like if I yeah, you should be able to go put Wind Whisper on any bottom slot. Okay. That's not really what I want to do. Four. <sighs> too, too many choices. Too many choices. Ah! Will of the Wisp. Will of the Wisp. Uh, ten, 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 ten. Mindful Owl is good. Um, I think I'm just going to go Mindful Owl. And, uh, man, this hatchery, dude. Um. And then, um, I don't know, Wind Whisper? I guess I'll take this Wind Whisper and throw it on, uh, because she's worth a point. I don't know. It's a play. It's a play. It's a play. Uh, discard, yeah. yeah. I think wow. it should be safe for me to push a little bit. That was an awful turn. I spoiled. God darn it. <laughs> oh, you did? Oh, no. <laughs> it was supposed to be safe for me to push for like a couple. Oh, no. The probability was supposed to be for me to push a couple times, but. Oh, and I got an awful great. turn myself. Miles out. Awesome. Here's Bill I am. Yeah. Dude, what happened? Yeah, it's just this race for VP. Ah. Oh, I just sort of want a bomb VP turn on that. I yeah. Just, I just want a bomb VP turn, and I just got an awful draw just now. Bill, go for it. He's taking the six. He takes the VP. Mm-hmm. Oh, he's going to try to come up on you, Lyle. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Boom. Wow. Okay. And I got this okay. pleb turn. I got a pleb okay. turn right here. Four, five, six, seven. <sighs> come with it now. Come with it now. I come with it now, dude. I, dude, I can't do anything. I might as well just push. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Now I can get a hatchery. What would I throw that on? If I can, if I can nail this, one time. Dang, dude, that would have been red. Oh. <laughs> now we're all just spoiling out of greed. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe I lost out there. All, all right. right, we got, we got, we got things we can do here. All right, bye, 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 bye. Right, bye, bye. Yeah, I'm Go gonna spoil if I push so let's not do that you got money you got symbols you got symbols you can go azure lake yeah i can get an azure lake what but that symbols? azure lake does not give me a uh point oh did i miss out on buying something last turn i might have missed out on a veil i don't know if i did but i think i'm gonna grab the azure lake anyway because gain a buck yeah um your dude you can upgrade my dude. Oh, you never upgraded your dude. Yeah, I know. It costs five to upgrade. And I can grab the overgrowth. Mm -hmm. Get real. Ooh, in-game points. In-game points. Not bad. Yep. Hmm. It's got deep. It's got deep. It got overgrown. This got overgrown. 
Yeah. I would say this is mad overgrown right now. Oh, he levels him up. Level levels up. What do you do now? Player two left and right mid discard their on deck card for each player. Oh, okay. So we can give you points. Yeah. I'm not discarding this card. Overgrowth. Oh, but All it's right. gonna be the first card in my pot. Dang it. Okay. Cool. Whoa, dude. Look at your in game VP just shot to 30. Yeah, I know, dude. Wow, dude. You made oh. you made moves. That was a move. I can't beat you guys on like this intern economy. You beat me by six right now. I need this hatchery card to drop second. I'm at seven, eight, nine, ten. So I have ten spoilages in my deck, dude. I could push and maybe get bank if I survive next turn. Come on, what are you doing, Bill? You better make a move, dude, because I'm making moves. Making moves. Let's see, I'm at 28. He's at 19. You're at 34. Yeah. I think I got to push, man. I got to push. We're get... making moves, dude. It's crazy. As it's there's crazy only 10 right points now. left. Dude, if I push and get my VP. Oh! I need some points. I need the 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 points. This is going to come down to what Bill does here. It's going to. He's got nine bucks, dude. What's he doing? What's he thinking? What's he calculating? What's he doing right now? Dude, I don't know what he's doing right now. Is he going to buy a Mr. Plow? He's hanging out on his switch. He's, he's calculating something, dude. He's a, he's hanging out on his switch a little too ca co uh, comfortably. What's he doing? What do you think you're doing, Bill? Oh, what oh. you want? Stealing for time. Exactly. <laughs> oh, he added the double. Oh, that's oh. a awesome protectoring card dude if he can get back to it this grove tinder's nuts now grove tender grove tender grove tender dude that sucks is he gonna buy a thingy is he gonna buy an azure or something what's he got he's got a sun two paws a sun and two paws exodus road looks like Whoop. okay two vp dude i'm it's falling getting, behind it's getting, it's getting points it's getting points dude i'm falling behind Gosh, is it 30? Three points left, dude. I gotta go for it. I gotta go for it. I gotta go. Gotta go. <sighs> oh no, I have to, I think. Oh, <laughs> oh it's gonna be good. This is gonna be good. That's awful. Ah! <laughs> Wait. Nice, dude. You have hatchery on this card, dude. Why is it telling me about my pool of light? It doesn't matter. Awful, dude. That what a way to go out, man. Yeah, dude. I was dominating. All right. I but think if, what we're gonna do is not spoil. I could, <laughs> I could yeah, push no, for uh, the win. I could try to push on my last turn if you if you take these three VP, dude. Let me let me just check here. I could. I don't know if I don't know if I have enough, so I'm just gonna play it safe and get this five deep here. Got that five deep here. I get one more turn, yeah, right. And I don't think I'm gonna buy hatchet because I don't want to. I actually don't want to cycle the deck for you guys. I don't want to cycle the marketplace because this one doesn't give anybody VP. You just bought something. He's just yeah. taking some in-game VP, yeah. So he's at yeah. 39. 
He took four, yeah, or something. Whatever he did. Uh, yeah, he gave me five. I gave you five. Yeah, so nothing gives you VP if, like, there's no VP marker on this card. The hatchery gives you no VP, right? No. Okay, so I think that's it, then. I'm not triggering. You're not going to trigger it? I can't. What can I buy? I don't know. Oh, no, I will trigger it, because I have uh, four on the board. Yep. This will trigger. Yep. How do you have four on the board? There it is. Final round. Final round! What? Oh, yeah, because I was the last person to go. So I just ended it. Oh, no, dude. I was so wild. Yeah, baby. You were third, dude. Because you spoiled at the end, dude. You should have just taken the third. I had such... What's up, Princess Johnfather coming what up, in? What Princess? Thank With the so sub. Thank you sub. so much for that. I'll take it. Come back. Bill, I am even got in there. Dang dude, it. Bill, that was nice, dude. Oh! Ow! Dude, I had my Yeah, baby, bombs. I got I got nine VP on that last turn. That was sweet. I had so many good cards that were gonna come up. Dude, I was just I was VP racing, dude. I feel bad, man. Oh God! Well, GG's, GG's, Bill. <laughs> GG's, GG's, Bill. Spilled so many oh, times. Really? He said, "I know, you weren't that far I behind, lot, Princess too. Shotfather." To celebrate, let's spin the wheel for Princess Chodfather right here because uh, we've got to spin the wheel. We've got to spin the wheel because the we wheel, could give away we got, we got this last giveaway. Because we have a giveaway, Princess. You're just in time to get your two times luck on winning a copy of this for Steam and potentially the Switch if you'd prefer. As we're celebrating that Switch giveaway. Oh, right before I go to bed. Yeah. But you know what? It's Well, that, that is correct. I did win both games. Lyle's Mystic Veil game. He's, he's an awesome druid. Um, toothpaste or Berry Blue? Courtesy of Princess Chopfire. Ooh, it's a fresh one. It's really soft. It's brushing my teeth. I'm brushing my teeth. <laughs> that's the worst one I got tonight, Princess. So that's a good, that's a win. <laughs> if that's the worst one I got. But thank you so much, Princess. And thank you, everyone, tonight. Thank you to Bill right there. It took us 19 turns. That was a grindy, uh, grindy turn. Just hit exclamation point ticket, Princess Chopfire, and you'll be entered to win. Or in yeah. exclamation yeah, point ticket. Your first ticket's free. Um, you can check your crits by doing exclamation point crits in chat. Um, each ticket is worth 10 crits. So depending on how many crits you have, you can do exclamation point ticket, singular, space, how many tickets you want to buy. Yeah, there you go, Princess. There's how many crits you have right there. And there you got one. And because you're a sub, now you have two. And you have 145 crits right now, which means you could actually buy 14 You can tickets. buy 14 tickets. And you can do exclamation point ticket, space, 14 if you want to go. Yeah, so everybody. As many tickets you can buy. Yeah, as Lyle's saying, you guys can win a copy of this game right here, Bill. Congratulations. Oh, and also because I, I won. Here, have uh, have uh, three tickets on us. Oh, because Lau <laughs> won twice. Free tickets. Free tickets for the people. So there you go. There you go, guys. There's Mystic Veil Digital before we give this thing away. Um, I was pushing for that helmet card so many turns. I know, dude. I was trying to go helmet strat. I think I went too hard helmet strat, uh, to be honest. My, my helmet, my leader, did not bank for me. I mean, it sort of did, but yeah, you guys would have pleb draws when I'd have her out. And I'm like... <laughs> it just didn't work out for me. But uh, guys, Mystic Veil Digital, currently now available on Nintendo Switch. That's why we're streaming tonight to celebrate that. So be sure you go get it. I believe the 10% might be up through the night um, if you want a discount there, uh, the pre-purchase discount. Uh, don't quote me on that if it's gone when you try to go buy it on the Switch. But um, we yep. are giving away one more copy, and then we're doing a long-range giveaway to our next stream of um, Mystic Veil. So if you're just checking it out or watching this on the VOD, you can still enter now. Uh, in either in our Twitch chat or by going to streamelements.com slash critcamp. Um, Lyle, are you ready to do this last giveaway? I'm ready to do this last giveaway. All right, here we go. Over so here. guys, last last chance to get in. I'm closing this thing in a few seconds here. In five, four. <laughs> okay, it's closed. <laughs> it is closed. All right, and we're drawing the winner here, the, the winner of our second giveaway. This one is courtesy of Bill. I am in chat. The nope. winner is OCS Specter, who had the most tickets in. Well, no, this is the this is the um, the last one was Bill. I am. This one is Nomad Games, because we already gave away one from Bill. Oh, already, okay. Yeah, right. this one. So this one is from Nomad Games, uh, courtesy of Nomad Games. The other one was as well, but Bill recycled it in for the first one. But right, this right. one here. 
Congratulations, OCS1, with that velvet rope. I hope you enjoy. Hope you enjoy the game, man. Um, it's awesome. All the support, guys. We appreciate it a ton. Thank you to Nomad Games. Let us know, OCS1. We'll get in touch with you if you want it for Switch or if you want it for Steam. Um, and we've got one more giveaway coming up to, to help thank you guys for supporting us. Uh, and a big thank you from Nomad Games for helping celebrate uh, the Switch release tonight with us. Uh, we hope you guys enjoy it, and we hope to play this more with you guys for sure. So Lyle's going to set Sorry. that up. I'm, I'm going to set up this giveaway that's going to run through uh, sometime next week when we'll do the when we'll do the winner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And sometime next week uh, when we stream, the next time we stream, we'll be drawing that winner. It, um, uh, Monday? <laughs> I'm thinking it's probably going to be Monday. I just got to figure out okay. what's going Sounds on. Sounds good. We yeah. can do Monday. Yeah, Monday. Probably Monday night. It might be another night stream, to be honest, which is crazy. Um, but yeah, it's another crazy Monday, guys. My schedule's been nuts, and I'm sure it's gonna be even more nuts with the uh, the madness of schools closing down and everything potentially. So, yep, everything, everything. It's a new new world order. Oh yeah. <laughs> so Lyle, the giveaway's open, guys, to win a copy of Mystic Digital v v v Mystic Veil Digital from Nomad Games. You guys can enter now. If you didn't win the last two, get in now. Get in now. And if you're just watching the vod through the weekend here on this reruns, it's open. You guys, there's a giveaway open. Hop in our Twitch chat, type exclamation point giveaway for that link, or go to streamelements.com slash quickcamp, and just be sure you're following us here. Subs get two times luck on Twitch. Yeah, That's man. That's right. Yeah, and congratulations to everybody that won stuff today. Mr. Draco, who won Talisman. Uh, Eric Laz, who won our first Mystic Veil vale giveaway, OCS1. Uh, Spectre, who won our second Mystic Veil vale giveaway, and good luck to everybody else who is joining the giveaway now. Yeah, good luck, good luck. And thank you, Will Baker. Have, everybody have a good night. We uh, definitely appreciate all the kind words. It was awesome seeing so many of you guys tonight doing a, a late-night Thursday stream, kind of off schedule, and you guys showing up to come hang out with us and celebrate the Switch release here uh, with Nomad Games. Be sure, once again, check it out. Hit them up on Twitter. Say you saw it on Crit Camp and that uh, you enjoyed it, hopefully. Um, we'll be playing this on the rerun and we'll be playing more Mystic Veil vale digital in the future. Um, and then remember it's cross platform. So if you have it on yep. PS4, Steam, Switch, iOS, Android, yep, iOS, Android, Steam, and Switch. That's like all the things, dude. That's like all the things. Yeah. I mean, like Bill is out of town in a hotel and he was playing on his Switch and he was on stream playing with us. And so he there, beat me. There you go, guys. And he freaking beat me in his hotel room bed on his Switch. And I'm on a, I'm on a, <laughs> PC. You could have beat him, dude. It was that last turn. Yeah. Cheats. That hacks. last turn. Jack, hacks. You can play everywhere, he says. That's awesome. No. So enjoy it, guys. Rock and roll. Um, Stormstrong's going to get it on the Switch because I need a, uh, need good use for it. <laughs> dude, <laughs> wow. There's lots of good stuff on the Switch, man. You got to bust it out. Um, and of course, yeah, big thanks. OCS1 says thanks to Nomad and Crit Camp for offering the codes. Yeah, you're, you're welcome, man. Thank you for the support. Awesome. This was good. This this uh, and, and hey, we've got one more Nomad game that we're probably going to be playing again sometime soon with some awesome giveaways. Smash Up's going to be making a return with yeah, a pretty pretty right. expansion. There's a new expansion for Smash Up, so yeah. uh we we'll probably yeah. yeah, not sure when, but soon. Yeah, soon. Soon. It's going to be fun. We've got some really cool giveaways for that from AEG and all that good stuff. So, we're going to sign off, guys. Congratulations all the remember to enter the giveaway. Lyle, you ready to get out of here? I'm ready to get out of here, dude. Dude, it was a long night of Mystic Veil, vale, and I'm done getting yeah. my butt kicked as a druid because I thought I had a win. <laughs> nice. Lyle, yeah. wash your hands. Wash your hands, everybody. Wash your hands, guys. Wash your hands. Take care of yourselves. Get lots of rest. And um, we hope to see you on the other side. We'll see you next week. Peace, good gaming. Peace, good gaming. Bye. Bye.